Yo, what is up everyone? Twist JCV here and we are back with a part 24 of Final Fantasy 15. Last part, firstly exploring without any story content. We did a bit of Colosseum, we did a lot of HUD missions, we got a sealed key and a mystery key. And now this time around we're actually gonna keep on going further adventures with all the side quests and all this other stuff we have to do. And also grind out a bit of the Colosseum to actually get the item that we're needing. So without further ado, let's actually get started. That's it. What's what? I've come up with a new recipe. <laughs> I can taste test for you. Okay, we are back into the world of Final Fantasy 15. Last part was, oh yeah, collecting the carrots. Do I actually have the carrots with me to sell, or is it already given them? Your veggies. Let's see. Yeah, I've already given them the carrots here. So the first thing I actually want to do for this part actually is go and find the Cerberus sniper rifle. So. This is one of the secret weapons in this game to find, and it's actually in one of the forts. The sniper rifle has literally not much damage, so it's not something of a gun that has damage involved. It's actually good for breaking. So breaking the opponent's armor, it's got the best properties to break the armor, so it's actually pretty interesting. As I usually say, like, oh, break this, break this in an enemy, break that, and when you break a property in the enemy, their stats go much more lower than expected and you can actually be piling on them. So this is something I do want to grab. So first things first, we're going to actually go back into our uh, mobile. And I know that I haven't really flown from the last part. So the two parts ago, we did get the flying regalia. And I haven't really flown too much in that area. But for now, I just use this really. I just drive from this to this and I just use the auto location. So the auto location is just to actually point them into that part of the map. They go into it, and then we can find where we need to get to. That's that is really it. I mean, any request of anyone wanting to see me do the flying regalia and you know make me crash into stuff, that's by all means. I I don't mind if people do want me to show that more often. So <laughs> I mean, it's a it's a fun vehicle to fly around. Really, I like the whole flying ship in JRPGs. It's Ready always in the Tales of yeah. series. Um, the old Final Fantasy games had uh, flying ships around as well. I wish that the modern ones actually did, like Final Fantasy XII. And I don't even know if Final Fantasy XVI has it. I haven't checked anything around it. But yes, we are here, and we need to go through this way, isn't it? We need to go in this direction here. So I'm going to tag it there. Oh, and we don't have... Oh, a chocobo! How fun! So he's gonna be running down. I forgot that we don't have the chocobo. Or does it actually save the progress of how much days you have the chocobo? Because like, I don't even think that my rental has ended with the chocobo at all. Not that I can remember. So, yeah, that's kind of strange, to be honest, that it's now ended and I can't really do anything. So I'm just gonna. Head over here to the entrance and find my sniper rifle, which is going to be in here. So you can see there are these guys in patrol. We're going to just ignore them. If they come in our way, then we bash their heads in. But for now, they are very low level, so it's not Beautiful something that day. I'm very curious Indeed. of actually doing. And for some weird reason, in this part, they do load up. Like, there's just a quick loading scene whereby they have to load up everything that's in here. Enemy plan of attack. Right okay. Gotcha. So, we we'll just suck these guys in. And take care of this big mech here. That's a parry. Okay, time to get out here before it explodes. Alright, so who's the next guy? Oh, he's up there. And that is it, all we have. We have some falling damage. Let's go. Yep. Okay. So we start from here, and then from the video I saw, we have to run this way. We run in this direction here. We go west into the building. There's gonna be a small cabin. And that is where we collect it. So this is the cabin. I'm gonna point as well, just to make things faster. So Oh, 
Well, never mind. Oh, you know what? Let's try and test out what the ring is with these guys here. That's one hit for these guys with the ring. Magitek's x at 24. This should take long. Yeah, just leave it to me, guys. You don't need to do anything. Okay, so from here, we go in here, and this shiny thing here, you pick it up. Here it is. It's the Cerberus. It, calls, it is called the Cerberus Micah. So, we're going to actually equip it. Uh, which one should we equip it to? We'll equip it here. So, we go into the machinery. And also, this is the only weapon that only Noctis can use. So, Prompto can't use this at all. And just to have a double check on this as well. Um, did I, if I equipped it, can I just look at it here again? Yeah. So, it's a sniper rifle wielded by Noctis. The scope enables precision targeting of appendages. Damage is 156. Like I said, it's not the strongest firearm you'll get in this game. But, it's very useful. So, we got it. So, let me just switch it out again. You can see how big it is. And, of course, we have Noctis ability. He holds it, but he puts in a different dimension. Okay. So, let's do the test. Can we actually shoot from here? Can we aim it from here, or do we have to get more closer? I think we just have to get more closer. Let's see. How about now? Okay, let's try. So what is the button to... So that's it. Hold it. Rude. Mega rude. Just wanna get a bit further away. Then, what is the aiming? How do we zoom in? I'm just trying to find out how to zoom in with this gun here. Oh my god, these guys. That's the shirt, and I actually got a break there. Engage the enemy with caution. Damn. Ready weapon. Yeah, ready weapon. How about... No, it's not actually... Okay, snipe. What's snipe? What's snipe? Wait, 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 wait. I see something. Roll dodge. So, why to snipe, I guess? Ah, uh, just get me away from there. Get me away from there. Let me um, get a bit to the, the edge here so they won't be able to target me. Okay, so now, snipe. Okay, so snipe to zoom in. You press the Y. This is how far you can do. And then press B to shoot, right? Yeah. So there you go. Next one. This one's just for you. Yeah, so that's it. And it's got a high rate of break. That's that's it. So I'm gonna test this around a bit more. I'm gonna try and find some other people to snipe their heads off. But yeah, it's not like something whereby it's a very powerful weapon at all. It's just a secret weapon in this game. Nothing fancy, nothing special. Except for the breaking. Hmm, nothing to grab here either, as well. Hmm, should I just get out here? Yeah, oh, yes, here's some guys. So again, you need to, yeah, so now we can do it. Shoot. There was a guy at the top here, right? Because these guys are really low level, it looks like the, the gun is powerful. Let me hear a body shot, a peepee -pee shot. Uh, where's the break? The break is not happening. We needn't waste more time. Yeah. Okay, so where is the other guys here in this area? Are they hanging up here? Oh, here we go. Sniper versus sniper. Oh damn it! I keep giving them headshots. Whatever. We're just going to get out of here. Actually, you know what? We can just return to the car. Return to the car right now. But yeah, that's, that's it. We're going to we're gonna be testing out the sniper in other places as well. And let's see with the quest list. So there's even one we can go to the Colosseum, which I feel like I don't want to do that right now. Um, a gift from Sid as well. So this is another thing we can do. So we need to find the secret of this key. This is something that you can get in Insomnia, so the present day. 
we have to head back into the present day of this game to do this part. So that's why I read. Um, let me go and have a look here. So let's head over to Hammerhead. I'm gonna head over to Hammerhead and then um, we're gonna get it there. So while this is loading, I can just go and to a YouTube video and just type in mysterious key. And then there might be a tutorial video where I actually need to go. So we've got the mysterious key. Um, oh, what's the name of this mission? This will be easier. If I actually type in the name of the mission, that will actually complete it much more faster because I can't find it at all unless I search on Google. Hmm. Let's go. Let's go to Google real quick. Okay, and we paste it like this. He said, we need to get the other key down the station rest point, then open the nearby gate for a shortcut, but to the, where that glaive with the holy unfitting voice was, he vanishes, then follow the locked gate just outside the outpost. Might want to stock up on potions and stuff. Nice. You're being helpful for a change. What do you mean for a change? So we go to the glaive in that section there. Yeah, okay. Let's go shopping. It works for me. So yeah, let's let's go and do that. They not. You coming or what? Cool Umbra, we're gonna go back to the present. We will just do the side quest. And we will showcase that off. Uh return to the present. These are our screenshots. Da, 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 da. All right. I didn't think I was actually gonna go back to the present, but this is the only thing for just this side quest here. Well, this will be cool. If we can actually go and use it for the Type D vehicle, that's what it says the Mystery Key is for. But it's only to be used in that present day of Insomnia. Okay, all good. So there we go. In the map, it's over here. So we'll go there right now. Which is the best way to go? Let's go this way. Oh yeah, we can also test out our snipers on these guys as well. So we'll do that as well. Do, do, do so okay some guys here demons on the prowl we can um increase damage on this as well this flowing death these guys don't actually have a break puppy here Oh, we've got the blind side as well. Uh, Ignis, overwhelm. I don't think we'll fight because we're using a firearm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, so it's strange. Like, with Prompto, he has a firearm, but he joins in the overwhelm. I think that's an auto aim when you do that without the zoom. Puppies, when you're just blinding fire with no aim, it does that. Okay. Um, so let's go. Should we go this way? Is this the right way to go? Let's try it. Let's go this way and check it out. Let's do this. Okay. Oh, yeah. Lose it. So, with me standing here, does that mean that these guys don't actually charge in? Yeah, because it feels as though, like, if I'm using the sniper, these guys don't go in. 
So we need to go a bit more further. Oh, we yeah, had cross chain. Hello. I find it more harder to try and get cross chains nowadays as well. It sucks. I love seeing the animation for the cross chain in this game. But we don't actually get it that much often. Final link. We got an eyeball out there. Have fun. But of course, everything we have. Yeah, we actually grabbed out the sword this time. Only when we grab out the sword we can charge in. Oh, does that really mean that Noctis isn't a party animation and he's just actually sniping away? I have no idea. Yes, we don't need to aim in here. Wow. This head bored me. Come get some. Glad that's over. Indeed. No time to Let's head over here. But of course. Your highness. Let's head to the left here. Here we go. So this is the place we need to go. We open it up. No way. The Regalia? What? It's an exact replica. I'd heard word of a spare car stored somewhere, but I doubted their veracity. Looks like the rumors were true after all. And yeah, it's all complete. This is what you get from a gift from Sid. And it's only in manual mode. So you can only just ride around this area. The Regali replica will not run out of gas. Ostar get to service the car when it's too damaged to drive. So Alright. Sure pulled out all the stops on this one. But now the old girl's So yeah, <laughs> it's just like you, just, you have a regalia here and you can just drive around. And you could just drive into guys again. Like, remember that like, the car can do that? It's like you can just ride around and just hit them. Which is not doing good effect against the red giant right now. Like look how much damage. It's only like 350 damage. And these guys are just pounding onto me. This is this is really great. You know what the regalia needs? It actually needs like a flamethrower, like a I reverse back. Okay, there we go. It needs like a flame for us, or something of a missile where you can shoot stuff out like we're playing tips to the metal. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's so bad. We're just leaving it right there, and now he's gonna start damaging the car. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, guys. I'll deal with you in a bit, but I don't want you guys to damage the car here. So let me um, let me park it in a better place for you guys. And then we can get down to business, yeah? Alright, here we go. So yeah, I think the best thing about that is just the fact that you just get extra free XP from doing that side mission. That's it. But other than that, I don't think I would ever be interested in actually riding with Galley anywhere like that, so... It's like, what's the point? So... <laughs> Yeah, let me just deal with these red giants, and then we'll just go back to the past anyway. And then we will do the secret dungeons. That's what I'm aiming to do. Because, yeah. Right now, this place doesn't feel necessary. It's good for XP um, hunting here. This is probably the best place right now to get free and higher XP. Because, yeah, if I actually level up my guy higher, I do want to face Omega here. Omega is like 120. <laughs> so we will come back to the present to have a go at Omega. I'm just trying right now just to farm better accessories until then. Because even if my level goes higher and higher, which does increase the health and vitality and everything else. And with my extension, I showed it there. Okay. I have no idea what happened now. I'm trying to get overwhelmed. Can I, can I just break it with the sniper here? Let's see with the sniper if I can break it. No. No break at all. Okay. Let's overwhelm this guy here. It's best to just use this. How about a break now? Yeah. 
No, we're not getting any bricks on this guy from shooting the sniper. Him. Sniper's ammo is on limit as well. I can just keep it shooting the B button. And there's no reload on the sniper. It's a project tower as well. You see that um, it floats in the air before hitting at the red castle as well. Anyway. And also, it's good to charge up the tech bar as well. So just by shooting a, a couple of shots there with the sniper, I, I've already got access to overwhelm again. Which is cool. I like it. Alright, let's head back to the car. And we'll drive right back in. Okay, we can't go any further in this point here. But yeah, that's all to it that we can do here. And I'm going to go back to the past now. Uh, where is my bed? Travel to Pass Lucius, yes. Traveling back to Pass Lucius, and we're gonna start the other quest of all those dungeons inside. But which ones to go first, though? That's the the real question. I think it will tell me what's the best level to go by how it is when we go into those secret dungeons, when we touch into those quests there, the list. But yeah, there's a total of eight of them, eight secret dungeons. Now we're gonna be doing. All right, here we go. Let's check it out now. This is 55, 65, 65, 72, 78, 89, 92, and then 99. So we go from lowest to highest. Menace beneath Lucis. Is this another one as well? Oh, this is just when we've done everything, we go back to her. Okay, so we're going to do Patriots first. That's the first ever dungeon in the main store you actually went to. So we're going to go there first. Okay. So let's run over there. And then... Map it over here. Oh, the furthest we can go to is by this outpost. Go back to the outpost. We're going to get the chocobo lined up as well. So we can run there much more faster. So, all good. We're here. It is quite comforting to see other people about. Head to the trench. Um, here's the chocobo. The chocobos. What is what does Pompto want to do every day? Ride the chocobos every day. Alright, where is the calling feature? Call chocobo. Let's go. Yeah, I feel like actually changing my color of my chocobos as well, but I haven't gone around to doing that. Anyways, let's head over to that dungeon and let's get that first secret dungeon done. Secret first dungeon done. Yeah, that, that 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 makes sense in my head. I think more of the sweat coming out of my face right now is really just due to how this PC always heats up my well the game always heats up my PC. I'm getting around like usual fifty to fifty five degrees. And we don't have like an installed AC. 
wait, wait, wait. Oh, you want some? Oh shit, find the person in distress as well. Ah, uh, stand still. Oh, you can actually zoom in even more. Damn. He keeps moving around so fast. Oh, these guys are in my way. Am I actually giving them friendly fire right now? Oh, I got him. Holy shit. He's got me. Alright, Prompter. Ah, the point warp just killed him. This sounds like you're having fun. Oh yeah, I did say that I actually wanted to find more people in distress around here as well. Rock and and save them. That'd be great to do. So someone's in distress right here. Now where are they exactly? Oh wait, I just have to change up the quest here. It says uh, there was still someone here. Find the person in distress. Where is it? Yeah, it actually opened up, dude. The side quest. It is not even here anymore. Oh, when you believe. Oh, there it is. What the hell? Open the sealed door? So, they... Oh, this is the person right here. Yeah. Okay. I think the distress quest are uh, activated at certain chapters. Because I've been here a long time, all the time here. And no one wasn't calling for help in the earlier chapters. Now I can do it now. Okay, so let's go to the quest, and where is it? This one, right here. Okay, now let's open the sealed door. So we're going to go through this dungeon again. Alright, what happened in this dungeon? Was this the one with the spider? I think this is the one with the spider involved when Take I did this the last time. Here. Most of the guys are like level 9, level 10. But yeah, this was kind of like the first encounter of actually getting a real taste of the demons at night because they were just locked in this dungeon here. Don't like the look of that ceiling. Yeah, long overdue for some TLC. Sure, hope it holds up. But yeah, this is actually a straightforward dungeon. It's something whereby like it's the easiest dungeon. It's not something that you'll be getting lost to. There's not really much pathways in this dungeon at all. Grab this. Sniper straight away, and you see it right here. But actually, allow me to actually hit them. I'm going all out. Just don't get too careful. You sure want to talk? Damn. Demons on the prowl. Ah, uh, let me just use my sword. I really want to use my sniper more often, but whatever. Onward. Ever wonder if people like okay. died here? And Is this the way to go? Sort of Can I open this? Okay. Uh, locked. Oh, it's locked. Do I have to do this puzzle again? It's worth seeking out. Maybe. I don't know. Whatever it is. Yeah, it looks like everything has been reset. Hey, what? wait. Need to brace for this. Okay, I'm gonna count to three. On three, you open the door. Got it? Hmm. All right. Okay. Here I go. One. Okay, Prompto. Two. Three. Um, you're not gonna... Bro, like, I can't even get through, and it's telling me to use summon here. Alright. If I can't get through, then the summon can get through, then. Hey, <laughs> Rammer is just gonna blow the whole K rope in. Right now. <laughs> he doesn't even care. <laughs> wow! <laughs> All that for like, what, level 7 goblins? Somehow Ignis got through. Storm ready to rage. Just say when. 
no, no, no one actually got through. We're still on this side right here. <laughs> it still won't open though. Okay, so we're gonna have to focus there. on this puzzle first now? and get everything open. Huh? Even though I've done this that? before. Wasn't oh, this before. is a way to go through here. Let's go through here then. Got a left and a right path. Gonna go left. Let's go through here. Check out this way. I just wish there was like a meter for the summons. So at least I can tell when the summons come in rather than this being RNG. That'd be great for this game if they had that. Uh... Uh. Elixir. Uh -huh. Yes, this was the dungeon whereby you'll get so much elixirs. You don't need anything else and there'll be so much elixirs that will restore your health all the time. 100%. Okay, so this is a dead end. There's a goblin. And there's another goblin. Okay. Nothing to it. It's reset all the enemies and also reset all the drops as well. Because I am picking a lot of elixirs up. So we got 200 feet to go. Okay, we're getting more closer. So let's see. So that is whereby we got this way arm. This is where the secret door is for actual main mission quest we're going to be doing right now. Opening up this door right here. So this would be the first door. This door here. Is it one of the seals? It seems highly likely. Well, yes, sir. We got the key. Do we use it? There's only eight of them because the rest of the seals were, well, rest of the royal arms was in the main quest. So those are like a total of five royal arms. And then the rest of them you can just get from these dungeons here. Even though some of the main quest was with dungeons. The game is like, well, instead of actually putting all 13, we're just going to put five. Hey now. Finally making some headway. At last we have broken the seal. Yeah, I don't think that means what you think it means. means we have to go. I know that. Oh. In there, in there? yeah. <laughs> um oh we can't do a quick save. Ah, uh, never mind. Defeat the monster lurking deep within. Okay. So first things up. Last thing I need now. Facing I a an imp here. Where is my break? We wasn't actually getting any break there, but whatever. We'll just do it the normal way. This is increased damage with the ultimate blade. Alright, Ignis, let's give it all we've got here. We get some good items here as well, don't we? Uh, well, not this item. It's just an Alexa. Um, so which is the next one? Is this the way to go? Okay, so it's locked. That way is locked. Okay. Oh, so it locks the way that we came in. Okay, good, good, good. Some of these secret dungeons have some puzzles as well. Let's um, blow them to oblivion here. That's two of them. This guy was actually far away, so he wasn't caught into it. We 
you have that was MP right here. But no worries, we still got you. Just don't hit me. We all good. Better than good. Good better than good good. Alright. High potion this time. So we got one pathway over here. Then yeah. This is the only way right now. Go further down. Alright, what do we have here? Homage time! Got one of them down. Second one's down. Number three. Oh, I ran out. Damn. Okay. That's cool. Got three of them down in the limit. an A plus but the D for the finesse I thought it was cool for an A for finesse use an armager there game is saying otherwise oh it's these guys that big has an explode and I actually switched to the right weapon as well I use I just switched to the pole and I was thinking to myself like maybe it could actually have increased damage which it does Oh, it's just one of them here? Okay, that's a greenstone crystal. What do we have here? A circlet. I don't think that's a good accessory. There's nothing you can actually grab these right here. So let me go and check it out. Yeah, it's just magic. Which I have not leveled up any parts of my magic right now. Okay, let's go further down. Oh, more of these guys. This guy paralyzed me as well. Is he gonna try to roll at me again? Nope. Okay, overwhelm time. Another Yellowstone Crystal too. Pick this up. Shattered timepiece. Alright. What's next? Let's go with this. How much we got? We got everyone but the guy right in front of us. He survives. I thought he would be the first one to get sucked in. Oh, there's another one here as well. That didn't get sucked in here as well. Yep, 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 yep. Oh, let me switch over to my ultimate blade for the increased damage. Alright, Prompto. Oh, hi there, opening. That's that. Got 6k on that shot there. Um, Prompto again. This could actually kill. Yep. There we go. None the worse for wear. Bring okay. on the next one. We got two different ways now. We got this way and this way. I'll take this way. Oh, this go makes us go up there. We go up this way. Yeah. That looks like the way that we came from. So we'll drop back down. So it's either that pathway, that pathway, or that pathway. So we're just gonna take this pathway then. This leads us over here and more steps downwards. Let's see if I can suck these guys in. Okay, that's cool. Splendid building stone. Alrighty. We keep going further down. Got the black bands here. Okay, here comes the parry. 
Come to. Oh, hi there, opening. Nice one, Bronco. Wow, that blindside leg. Heavy damage there. Let me um fight the blindside link with this guy as well. Sorry about that. Oh, he's on the ground. Hi, Pumta. Oh, hi there, opening. I'm impressed. It's nothing. Oh, is he trying to jump on me again? Yep, parry. Oh, my parry didn't come out there. We're in the home stretch. We needn't waste more time. Okay. All good. Now, what's this on the ground? Gold bangle. Wow, some really big stuff going on here. Can I give this over to Prompto? Oh, gold bangle is smaller than the temple shield we have right now. Alright, fair enough. Next room, down below. How should we do this, Not Just do this way. Over. This is how we're gonna do this. I potion. Alright, let's keep going down. Shall we camp here? Oh, there's a camp here. Dominator to collect up. And there's something here. When comes the night, let's shine the light. They want to vanquish these menaces. Must wait to seal the demons away from beneath the ground. When All right. the night, let shine the light. Translation? I'm pretty sure it's saying find the big bad monster and take it down. I don't wholly disagree with your interpretation, but it lacks nuance. Perhaps seeking more inscriptions will help elucidate their meaning. I guess it couldn't hurt. Huh. I thought it just meant that. Uh, let's put them in the dark and just... Trap them in there. Okay, Alright, we'll camp right here. You can remain away we get free AP for camping. Eat. More AP involved. Alright, can I get that food that gives us extra XP? So let me um, check. It says significantly increases it, but drastically reduces maximum HP and then increases experience points by 10%. There's one that's for 100%. I'm looking for that one. XP for 100% here. Um, magic, HP, attack. Hmm. HP by 1000. It's a juicy steak. Oh, here we go. Oh, but this is 30%. This is not 100% at all. Increases enemy item drop rate by 50%. Perception boost. Alright. We'll keep going. This is by 50%. Level 5. Looks like we probably have missed it. Um, 20%. This mullet sandwich. Hmm. This one's 10%. Um, 20%. 100%. This is the one. We need one of those, two of those, and four of those. Alright, cool. Shout out. So now you can see, after eating that, all of our guys are at 
9999 except for Prompto that's at 9592. Not only you get 100% boost of XP, you also get huge health added on, which is great. Stylish as always. Come now, it's nothing special. This one looks good. I like the purplish filter from the light. That's good. Cool. Striking a pose. Oh yeah. Yeah, we're all good. It only took nine foes until it wasn't a total of ten. Okay, so camp is done. All right. Mm -hmm. Let's move on. They're level fifty here. Okay. <laughs> Blindside links and link strikes are guaranteed kill of these enemies. Alright, let's pick it up. High potion. Cool. More curatives. Marshmallow this time. Again. <laughs> One hit strike. How about this guy? Wow. Okay. You want someone to slap me across my face then? Laser sensor. Oh, is this the thing again whereby you have to go through this, this, or this? Yeah. Let's go yeah. through this way. If we go through this way, does this. What does this do? Oh, it goes this way. So, yeah, we're taking the right path instead of the left path. There we go. Oh, he's over there now. We needn't waste more time. What do we have? Oh yeah. D base coin. Gotcha. Good blind sailing. Now you try and pull him up with a scary face. It was ineffective against Pro um, Noctis. Ah, didn't get the parry there in time. Right, splendid building stone. This looks to be a dead end. Yeah. We'll take the middle path then. Next. So there's that and then there's that. Yeah. So we just have to keep going up. Yeah. Okay. So there's that path there, and then there's this middle path here. We'll take this one next. Say your prayers. That was so hard. It takes two. Let's use Armager here. Ah! The Prince of Pain. Yep. Nothing to it. And an Earth gemstone. All these eyes that we picked up so far hasn't been anything special at all. She's the ring here. How many times? Enough talk. Time for some action. Just one more now. Oh yeah, because we we're on stations, we couldn't parry that. Gold bangle. Another gold bangle. And look at our XP. It's over 10k. Of XP. Oh, it's the heck guy, guys. Now, it's hard to find where the blind side is. Because they're looking everywhere. But there is a blind side to these enemies. There is a bat. <laughs> Strangely enough. 
Are they actually healing themselves up there, the blue light? Beautiful bottle. Alright, now let's drop down here. More heck eyes. Let's see what heck eyes can do against this spell. That guy survived. Oh, I'm confused. That's why now. Yeah. Okay. Do I have my thing ready? Yeah, I do. Oh, good. So we came up through this door, and again, we have the three pathways. Uh, I guess I'll try to take left. Oh, more okay, cat guys. Oh, and it's an increased damage when you use the ultimate blade on it. Cool. Oh, it shows it right here. Yeah, we've actually got the scan on them. It now pops up. Perfect or what? I'll give you that. Sky gemstone. Really? Okay, good parry. And that's it. Gladio got him. What did you expect? What do we have here? A wizard shield. Wizard shield? Okay. Wizard shield is 225. Greatly empowering spells. Execute and blink boost attack strength. Alright. Huh. Yeah, it's actually low in terms of damage. And this is a dead end. Alright. We'll make our way back up then. Okay, so the door's over there and there's another door over there. We'll take the middle path over here. Try where this one leads us up to. It's certainly a puzzle in the second half here. Okay, now you're definitely dead with this link strike. That's what I call teamwork. Oh, of course, Sentry Coin. It's history now. Oh yeah, I haven't actually been able to use these all called Sentry Coins at all. They're supposed to be for that game, right? Oh, it's Ignis Lock. Okay, no, never mind. You can slide through. Go. What did you expect? You like that? Solid. You're on fire today. Actually, you know what? You don't need to use the rig. No, that guy was still trying to parry me. I just dodged him. I thought he was going off for someone else, but then he just ran around and hit me. The marshmallow. Prismatic shard. There was something else that we grabbed here. Oh, that was the thing we grabbed. Okay. Prismatic shard. Let's move. Yeah. Let's use the ring. 
That's free. We'll hold on to our armager for the next fight. Oh, we got the blind side. That was the blind side right there. Just ether. So far, we've actually been up for five hours during the second part of this dungeon. Oh, and it is this the Lakmu Flan. All right. What is going on? I can't actually use my. Whoa. I was trying to use my warp to go onto him, but it wouldn't allow me to. Oh, wow, look at this. On the spear. Perhaps that is the only thing that can actually just keep an infinite find him like this. Oh, nope. Alright, overwhelm time, boys. What? My overwhelm didn't. Oh, he. Dog himself underneath. Uh, never mind. Alright, Prompto. I've only got one bar. Hi there, opening. <laughs> Look at this. It's like an infinite loop until he jumps onto the ground. That's cool. Alright, we parry this and we go into the overall afterwards. Shit! Now he actually gets his cross chain. Oh, I don't think I'll be able to do it in time. God oh, damn it! I, I I hit on overall, but yeah, you can't cancel it out to go into the cross chain. We're gonna miss it right now. Yep. We got armager back. Oh, now my warp works? First time I used this, the warp would not work at all. Give me another cross chain. Make him vulnerable, make him stagger. Ah, uh, never mind. Alright, overwhelm time. Oh, so this was the evil menace? Alright. The monster's finished. Just a huge blob. Oh, Hyper Magnum! We got a Magnum now. Um, let's see here. So, let's switch out to the Magnum. 388 in damage. This is the strongest firearm. Gun designed with devil simple devastation of mind. Though it harbors no enchantments, it fires rounds of exceptional force. Alright, let's give this a go. Damn. Okay. That's that. Oh. So that just completes it. Yeah, that completes it all together. So the next one we go to is Grotto. This one... Where is this located? Grotto. Where was that? Essentially, but yeah. That's one down, seven to go. And I'm locked in. Huh. <sighs> Man, it's hot. Then lose the jacket. But was there a another way to get out of there? What's this? Okay, that's just to get our MP back. Return to entrance. Let's use this. 
It's the only way to get back. Okay, I'm gonna go for a save here. Hmm, we've actually used up about 33%. That looks like it. Another two and a half to go. And then on the map, where is exactly the blue mark? I see a blue mark. Oh, it's over here. This is where Grotto is. Tomb on the Wanderer. Which one is this one? Exactly. Hmm. This is the next one. Hey, Fairy. How's it going today? How's your weekend so far? Let's return to the car. Oh, car. Hasten me to the toll. The regalia to the heaven. I just want to return to the car right now. Oh, you're going to be going to bed soon? We need to replenish our supply of curative. Uh, let's park it right here. I'm actually quite sweaty. He is picked up again today. Before it was a bit chill, but Reva's actually picked up. We get around 15 to 20 degrees today. But other than that, everything's always good. So what's next? Ask around a little? It's up to Noct. Oh, this was the waterfall dungeon. I see. Find shelter yeah, I remember this cold. now. This is where we're going to be going to. With the icky bicky spiders. And the demons. There's going to be a snake here as well, isn't it? We can take out real quick. In this area. Get free XP. Oh, can I actually use my chocobo in this little area? Yes, I can. All right. Easy now. There it is. Thanks for the ride. Let's go for a test. Nice ride. Candy ring of Lucille. Take this out in one hit. Let's go. Hey, hold on. Showtime. Let's hope it's not a How about now? Oh, Showtime. the Chocobo wants to fight here. Oh, it just wants to boost up my stats. Okay, let's go for it now. Ah, oh, missed. How about the Magnum? It feels like a normal firearm. The sound doesn't sound like as if it's a Magnum. Look at the rate of fire as well. That is not what Magnum would be like. Alright, overwhelm the snake. Come to. Oh, hi there, opening. <laughs> he missed a shot there, from the. Yes, sir. Okay, we need to get out of here. Oh, we got the break. Nice. Alright, overwhelm time, guys. Still didn't get staggered. Yes. Oh, now he's poisoned. Okay, now he gets staggered. Ryan, right the last point. Alright, no cost chain opportunity. Alright, so 47k of experience we got now. But this is 
totally like King's Knight. Uh huh. There's four of us, just like in the game. Well, then I gotta be a five star. So often when we do this dungeon, I'm gonna actually head back over to what's its um, face, uh, Golden Key. We get the two times experience for sleeping there. I'm gonna have over 100k experience. That's gonna be great. Oh, we don't actually have three bars yet for Gladius. Okay, there we go. Hey, sorry. All done. What do we have here? What it's gained in size, it will have lost in flavor. That's what you're hung up about. Skya turmeric. All right. Onward. Right. Okay, let's go through here. Into the waterfall. Glacier Glacial Grotto. Pitch black in here. Otherwise known as Waterfall Dungeon. That's what I like to call it, because I will actually forget uh, that long name not a fan of on my side. Desserts. Let's be one shot. Okay, with the rake. Okay, because I was just looking at the level. Alright, that's that. Also, shell. Let's go. Yep. So there's two sliding parts here. So this is the slide, the first slide. We got that board coming up soon as well. What is this little shiny thing in this corner here? A potion. Alright. Now, oh, so we go up from here. Where's the next slide? Yeah, this is the next one. Pick this up. The game's always so generous of giving so much code of items. You don't need to go to the shop. Nothing to it. Oh, you don't want to be here me. I'll get my holy item on you guys if you do that. Nice, so. That does way more damage compared to just pressing B there. It's at 9999. And it's their weakness because it's light magic. What do we have here? Fossil shell. Now that we just need to make our way to the other side here. It's shiny here. Star pendant, alright. Okay. So we go through here. We go to that green part on the map. Oh, okay, before that, grab this elixir. Yes, so this is the way to go. I still hear them. <laughs> Wherever they are, these imps. Uh, okay. Flat over there. Oh, they're over there, the imps. Onward. Yep. Um, which way? Can I hit them from down here? Yeah. All right.
So if I don't trigger a battle sequence, does the experience still get on uh, my side? Uh, yes, lightning energy is four. Oh, there's something shiny up top here. Fossil wood. Again? Oh, this is so convenient. Use the ring. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, oh, I see. So we have to go all the way around to that location there. All right, gotcha. Oh no, I don't want to slide down. No, 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 no. Is there a way to get up there? Uh, yeah. All right. So this is the way. Oh, but then I need Let's to. Do this. Yeah. Right. Okay, so I have to get up there. How many times? Enough talk. Time for some action. More is just coming right through the corner there. Yeah, there's something Let's shiny go. here. Indeed. Hm. Ancient dragon tooth. Temper, temper. If I go this way, oh, there's something shiny down here as well. Elixir. All right, cool, cool, cool. Okay. Um, where can I find the area to actually get higher? Oh yeah. I made an oopsie. And on we go. Right. I made a bit of an oopsie. So where is the way to go from here? about this way okay um let's go, let's let's try this way yes yeah, so this is where we was before See the lighting. Yep. Now I just have to make sure I don't slide down. Good. Now we can make it through. Oh, this ring is so convenient. You guys don't need to back me up at all. We're good. So the royal tomb is on that side. I want to go here. Here's the door. Alright, does these guys have another rip of voice lines here to say? No, no. These guys are quite quiet this time around. Let's hit 
defeat the monster lurking deep within. Let's see what uh, puzzle we get this time. Do we actually get the same puzzle from last time? We get different dice here. Let's go Jimbo. We actually get potion. Back to it. Right. So far, it looks the same as the last dungeon that we got. Different enemies, though. See how good this link strike does. Oh no, <laughs> he caught his link strike. Okay, let's try again. Okay, we get a link strike there. Good. Bluestone or and this is high potion right now. Skeletons, eh? This should nah, nah. You guys aren't worthy for the ring. I'll take you out with my sword. Good job. More ancient dragon too. Let's go. Let's use the uh, magnum. How good is the magnum against these skeletons here? Stop bitching, start killing. Ah, it sucks. Oh wait, the ring is good against these skeletons here. All by myself. Wow. Black belt. What does black belt give us? It's an accessory exclusive for Gladio. Significant increases attack and strength threat and fighting massive foes. We'll use that once we can slot in Gladio for two accessories, which by the way, how much ascension AP do we have? We got a total of 167. Alright. We'll grab more AP instead of using the points right now. How about this? Does this work good for these guys here? It actually does. Be nice to brighten things up in here. That's cool. Onward. Hm. Yep. But yeah, we're actually at a point. Without ring that this one shots everyone. Very convenient. Of course, Sension coin. And yeah, I can use the ring again on these guys. Get back! Not good. That is in the dark. Now imagine you were using a gun. What do we have here? Ether. All right. More skeletons in this area. This one's there you go. Here's some holy for you. If you want to just run into me. What do we have here? Mega Elixir. Let's move. Yeah. How does this work on your Jimbo? Very similar. All right. How about Holy? Oh, it got vulnerable for a moment there. <laughs> That's cool. Oh, no. oh, I missed the um the holy spell. Yeah, I'm not holy spell. Oh, now he's shooting this stuff at me. All done. Mega potion.
Even the great Jojimbo. Oh, here's a cap. Vigilantes we get here. So let's go to Ignis. If Vigilante is strong, then these real cosplayers. Apparently, this is the best weapon that Randolph used to actually gray us the weapon. It's that she at 345, but Vigilante is at 290. But hey, we can give this to Noctis. The Vigilantes. What do we have here? And it's another poetry going on here. Land, hand, soul, atoll. But these guys have nothing to say about it. All right, we're gonna camp. Wait, are we seriously sleeping here? You see a better place? Yeah, unfortunately, we couldn't actually get an extra two times for the experience at Golden Key. So we'll just camp here. No extra bonus at all. Let's see if we can get the XP for the next one as well. So attack boost, HP boost, and 50%. Wait, where is it? So it was at the top here. Oh, here we go. No, this is 20%. XP boost. This is 50. That's half of what you get, you get extra. Attack boost. Technician. This one's 30%. Where are you? Equalizer increases damage dealt on the level difference between the party enemies. Oh, so this is good for something whereby it's lower health enemies. It damages it much more faster. Okay. Oh, this is the one. Oh, but we don't have the stock anymore. Darn it. We have no more. That's something I want to kind of farm to get. As well, unless it's kind of close. Anyways, let's get for the 50% instead. Okay, so if we go all the way to the top, we'll find it. 50% XP. 20%... Critical boost. HP boost. Okay, this one. We'll eat this one for now. This is the best thing we can do. Ta da! Stacked ham sandwich. Increase the maximum HP. Oh, yeah. We're going to lose our boost of what we had last time about HP. So you can see that the only one that's actually at max HP is Gladius right now. But look how much XP we're going to get right now. Okay, that was close to 90. Or Noctis. Look at you. Striking a pose. Oh yeah. Wait, was that Gentiana? Oh yeah. That's Gentiana right there. She snuck into the fur. And this place was crawling with nasties. Gentiana. Actually, to be fair, Gentiana would be lurking them anyway, because Noctis has got her as a summon now. Feeling refreshed. Well, but anyways, it was always her more. job to watch over him, anyways, from afar. Him and Luna. Last thing I need now. Eyes peeled, not closed. But yeah, to be fair, I'm just gonna just use the ring. Oh no, no, I need to try out the daggers actually. Right. Let's give the daggers a go. Do they change animations or they're pretty much the same? That's what I've noticed is like if you use any weapon from that Tron family, like it's just say any dagger, 
the attacks, the way how they swing this weapon gun is pretty much all the same. But if we actually look more closely to the daggers, they might actually look a bit different. I don't know, maybe color or design, let's say. The only thing about the daggers is that they're not good to stagger anyone. That's what I've noticed. Like, you can do more amount of hits, but even on the weakest enemy, they could just hit you out of nowhere. Okay, so we got through there. There's one door here. Yep, it's the exact same thing as the last one. You got three choices. I'm gonna go with this choice here, the left side. So the puzzle hasn't changed at all. Same thing. Choose one of the three doors. Two of them are gonna be a dead end, whereby one is actually gonna make you go further. Oh, an the elder one. Is charged from the part of okay. Okay, Prompto's going through. Damn. Okay, I'm down. Yeah, it's just me and Prompto. Alright, I'm just gonna use the sword. Now, where is Ignis? Just wait on Ignis and then I can actually do it, but... Okay, Ignis is there. Oh, hi there, opening. And it's vulnerable. Omanite Bustle. You know what? I'm just gonna use armage right here. No break. Okay, but we got the guy staggered and vulnerable. He did get the break. And he is Donzo. Donzo, Donzo. All done. Mega Elixir. Oh, this is the dead end. So, yeah, this is the path that won't make us go further down. So, we're gonna actually head back. We'll take the middle path next time. Alright, so the middle path is over here. Shit. There we go. Stamina back. Let's do this. Oh, another! Elder Cure. Oh, he's vulnerable again. But a blindside a full bit. Damn! That must have been a quick blindside. Okay, so let's go down. Another one right here. Oh, time for some action. Oh, was it trying to parry? Oh, we missed the follow-up parry here. Good job with the poison. Yeah, let's go. And the break. Oh, it's another Dunzo. Yeah, this is another dead end. Okay, so there's a similar pan I can see here. The dead ends would have an annoying monster, whereby the one that's not a dead end, it would have one entryway connected to another entryway right at the beginning. Alright. Let me swap over my fingers around to make it easier to run. Um, so this is the right pathway. Let me see if my hunch is correct. So yes, 
You go through first, and then there's another door here. It always happens when it's the correct one. And then you go down this way. Yeah. Okay, the enemy thing is still the same. So, I thought it would be a different enemy here. Just to alert, like, oh yeah, you reached the, the right pathway. But no. And now it's vulnerable. Okay, some more riskers. No big deal. What do we have here as well? Oh yeah. D base silver piece. Huh? They give us some good experience though, these leopards. Over 20k. Could I or nade? Really? Again? Oh, we need to go inside here. Now it counts as XP. Gotcha. What do we have? High potion. Uh, another one of these. Fair enough. I think if we just hold B, we are just getting this guy staggered all the time, but then if we don't keep the pressure, then he's able to spin around like that. All right, let's just um, heal up. There we go. The blind telling got him in that vulnerable state there. There we go. Another potion. We got a potion right at the beginning. And a second potion. Yep, this is definitely the right way. You know what? We should just use our armor in the beginning. Good break. Prompto, give me that crit. And he stopped as well. Who got the time stop on him? I see that at times. We get sometimes the stop on the monster and he can't really do anything at all. So yeah, again, we have the three ways. What is this though? Oh, this is just the monster. Alright, let's make it to the left there. Oh, this is the right way. Yep, this is the right way. I have a feeling this is the right way, based on what I said earlier. Let's do this. Uh, right. no more Mr. Nice guy. Claudio, oh, it. we got the blind side link there. Okay, cool. It's me and Gladio. Okay, from us through. And Ignis is here. Oh, somehow he was able to spin there. There we go. Not good to throw daggers in the dark. Be nice to brighten things up in here. Let's see if I am and right. And this right. is the right way to go. And it's not a dead end. Uh, we're going poison and okay, okay, good, good, good. Blind side. Bam! And the break comes in as well. Gonzo! No! My guess was wrong. <laughs> this was a dead end. This wasn't the right way to come through. Even though it lined up as if my assumptions were fully right there, no.
<clears throat> okay, I will just take the middle pathway then. Alright, so is this the way? So one, two, three, yeah. Alright, mid path. Uh, okay. Let's try it this time. Hey, Yuki! I'm doing good, Yuki. How are you doing today? Here goes the sucky sucky with the rings. Mega potion. You slept for 30 hours. Oh, that's cool. Did you get something to eat this morning? Ah, <laughs> chunky chicken underground. Let's go. Indifa. Yeah, so this is the only way. Yeah. Oh, you're too lazy to get up, so you're, you're already actually in your bed right now? Gotcha. Oh, you know what? Let's go Armager here. Nothing too personal, eh? Prismatic shard. Another yeah. camp? Wait, what? Yeah, it's definitely another camp. Because... This is different writings here. Let's call it a day. I'll see what I can whip up. <laughs> yep, just staring at my ceiling. <laughs> Have you got any plans this weekend, Yuki? Fifty percent. Where's my XP? Fifty percent. There we go. Fifty percent XP boost. Ta da! Stacked ham sandwich. Noctis is the first one at level 90. 10 more levels to go to get to level 100. They're cute. In an ugly sort of way. Oh, but you can't see in this photo from too. Oh, you're going to be okay, visiting okay. your friend later today? Should be a hit. Nice. Perfect timing. Was you able to get um, all the stuff moved into your friend's apartment the other day? I think he was doing it during this week. Moving stuff. Look at you. Yeah, I know. Why you gotta be so photogenic? I likes. I yeah. likes. <laughs> Even though Prompter says that annoyingly, sometimes it's like it, it catches my head when he says that. It's all moved in. Great. <laughs> Nailed it. Why can't I warp too? So unfair. Alright, camping's I'm done. Just about awake. So that's two camps. The last dungeon was just one camp to sleep in. Alright, we're gonna keep him going down. Say your prayers. Here I 
Now ring time. So this is the skeleton. Give me the boop boop beep treatment. Nothing to it. We grab a beautiful bottle. I can't take it anymore. All this fighting treading nuts. Ah, come on, Prompto. It's a little bit longer. Hi Elixir. There you go. That covers up from using it earlier against the Kuros. Should we be a bit more closer? No, we do it. Oh my god. What was that Pokemon that looks like this? A Glalie? I think they're called Glalies. In the third generation. Alright, sure thing, Yuki. And we got an Earth Gemstone here. Well, no one hit them. Oh, is this the... Big guy? No? It doesn't sound like an actual... Boss. Just normal... Seems Pronto's been intoxicated. Enemy music, but the guy's at level 70. Alright, Pronto. Oh, hi there, opening. <laughs> Damn. Trying to kick me in the face. Were they this big, like, in the Coliseum? The King of Trice? Fine tail feathers. Better than good. Good to go. Hey Chloe! How you doing today? How was your weekend so far? Get poisoned or something. Wow, they look super goofy when you just suck the soul out. In the ring. Guy Gemstone. Just can't take a hint. Man. Every time we get holy, it's like 9999 damage. Heavenly on the ring because you always have to dodge when Sorry. they try to attack you. No way else to actually trigger that. No use hanging around here. Indeed. I'm doing good, Chloe. How are you doing? Uh, I think I could handle this all by myself. Uh, Damn. One more to go. Flynn is getting married today. Oh, no worries. Go see your buddy. Go see your pal Flynn. By all means. Last thing I need now. It's a very special day for her. You was invited. Does she live nearby you? High potion, alright. Oh, okay, we've got the free pathway. I'm just gonna just choose the left pathway, whenever. But with the Rizwin tooth and all that, being in pain, you couldn't go. Oh, so she was originally from Malaysia, but she's um, come down. Is actually in. Europe now, cool. Get back. Was, is Antwerp in Europe? I have no idea. <laughs> I think that's a city in your country, right? Shit. Ignis. 
Why is there so many of them here? Bro. Let me just get my thing. Is it is it ready now? Yeah it is. Alright. They're like coming in packs of two and three. Now it is coming like eight right in front of my face. That's what you guys get. Would have liked to wrap that up more quickly. Right, Ignis? Oh, here comes the boss, right? This is boss five. Oh yeah. Kengo, the Ujimbo. Alright, we'll go with the first part of the parry. Oh, that was a quick parry there. And then Link Strike. That did literally nothing. And did it with a blind side. We got poison there at least, and then we can actually trigger it again with a blindside link. Yo. What is Gladio doing? You see how he's just charging up his sword there? That was weird, bro. It's like you're charging up, and then he actually got out of it. Oh, Prompto's down. Uh, let's go with the Mega Phoenix. Is it Mega Phoenix that we can just get everyone up? Yeah. Okay, right, cool. Here's a chance. Can we get the break on him on the Overworld? Overworld is good for the break as well. There's a chance of a break. Okay, it's, uh, Yep, here we go. Comes the blind selling. Can I want to just drop this off with Prompto? Alright, Prompto again. Oh, complete. Let's go. Done and dusted, boys. I even amaze Impressive. myself sometimes. Your ego is what amazes me. Frankly, I'm just amazed we actually made it. Fair enough, fair enough. The Executioner is the next weapon we can grab up here. Alright. Let's pull up to Noctis. The Executioner, eh? Um, where is it? Over here. 363 damage is not as strong as the Magnum, but this one is designed to devastate stationary targets, inflicts extra arm when used upon vulnerable foes. And what's that plus 22 sign? Is that light? What's the sun? Um, the guide. Let's see. It's spirit. Base that for determining damage incurred from magical attacks. Oh. Okay. So that's what it does. Well, let's just change it. Or should we give it to Prompto? What does Prompto have actually? He has this. We can switch the Quicksilver to give him Hyper Magnum so he gets a lot of damage. Because he's going to be using that primarily for his gun. I don't really need to care about the magnet. I just, I just want to test out these new weapons we get. So let me see what the design looks like here. What does that even look like? Um, what's the weapon called again? It's a executioner. Hmm. A sub pistol, I guess. I don't know. All right, let's return to the entrance. <sighs> I'm done.
Can I drop down here from here? Alright, cool. And does this big snake <laughs> respawn? Because I've actually been there for over two days now. Oh, it is there! It has respawned, that big snake. Get to fire again. Cool. Alright, so to test out the executioner. It sounds like a pea sure. Make you happy, especially something this big. Yeah, this sounds like a pee pistol, really. I, mean, I can just roll around. Wait, here we go. Like, you can just do that, yeah. But, Gladio, take care of these guys. Sorry. It'd be great if they had um, different effects to these firearms, the way how they sound, the way how they f have the fire rate to it. But yeah, it's just like, oh, I got another gun that sounds exactly the same as the other gun, but with a different design when Noctis pulls it up. Alright, let's see if we can one-shot this again. Sounds sus indeed, yeah. Bro, it missed again. Damn. I wanted to go with Overwhelm first. There we go. Armature mode doesn't actually drain our health that drastically at all. Oh, it's because of poison, that's why. Oh, I see. Um, oh, summon time. Yeah, I don't, I don't really like these Magitek guys either, so I let the summon whoever it is take care of them. It's Leviathan! Leviathan has actually been summoned more often compared to Ramua. It's like, oh yeah, you take me away from where we are in Atlassia, and you put me over here. And again, there's a lot of water nearby. <laughs> we don't even see where them actually get drained up, the Magitek guys. It's just like, oh yeah, we just see the stats. Of the experience coming in, rather than anything else. <laughs> but yeah, you see the after effects. Ah, oh. okay. The after effects would usually be that you'll see Noctis's eyes be glowing pink and purple, but it's already gone now. Um, we should return to the car. And what is the time as well in the game? So what time do you have? We got 12 o'clock. Um, we'll go for a quick save anyway. But yeah, that's two out of eight dungeons completed right now. Go for the third one. So the next one is over here. Malachi Hills. Oh. Yes, 12 o'clock in the game. Yeah, yeah, it's actually coming close to 1 p.m. right now, yeah. Time moves so fast. Nearly about two hours since I've been streaming today.
Here we are. <sighs> okay. We made it. And how far are we now? Hmm. Doesn't show how much in terms of meat is here, but I'm just gonna just pull up with my chocobo. Um, where is the rent in post for the chocobos? Oh, it's over there. Oh, hello, Riz. So what'll it be today? Y'all still keeping on, keeping on? Oh, you only I'll got five hunt missions, Riz. Before you'd be updated oh. by now. All right. Let's call out our chocobo. Where is he? Oh, he's over there, fighting with a bush. Oh yeah, I'll come over to you. Let's go. Is that Pepper Pig? Hi. Ah. Yeah, I, I I know about the cartoon, but I've never seen it. Did you get, um, what's it called? Um, did you meet like your sub goal to get an extra email? Yeah, I mean, like when I was as a kid, I didn't actually watch that show. You got trusted by Twitch, so Twitch just gives you a new email. Just like a free one, huh? And on we go. Indeed. Right. Oh, right. I see. How long does it take to get that? Whereby you can just upload emails without approval. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. But the followers get five emotes as well, yeah. Remember, they're just a scared of us. Easy as they come. Gotcha! Oh, damn. Here goes so, does that mean that you're just going to be creating five new emotes for every of your followers? Oh yes, on top of here. Like you know the followers getting five emotes now? Did you make five new emotes? Oh no, you didn't. So the emotes that the followers get is exactly the same as the subs. Color's amazing. Oh, it's different. Huh? Oh, you only got two for now. Oh yeah, I need to save. Let me save real quick. Uh, oh, it doesn't want me to say save here. No. How about now? Yeah, there you go. Got two for followers and same for subs. Huh. Pitch black in here. That was one for followers. I can't actually tell which um the picture is for the second one so I know the the one on the left is Peppa Pig but I don't know what's that for the second one you have there oh that's you is that you when you was younger
Okay, okay. So the next picture you just posted, is that for your subscribers there? And that one as well. Bits. Oh, the Bits um, Awards. Yeah. I did that recently. Um, create the emotes for the Bits Awards. And then I was doing a couple of the badges as well. I wanted to work a lot more on the bit side. I think the bits are really cool. So I did some of the badges and the emote rewards for the bits. I think they're, they're what I want to work on the most. Bits, you say? Yeah, bits are cool. I like the bits. Bro, I didn't even get out of that corner. That's a ham sandwich, Amida. Isn't it wonderful when effort is <laughs> Bits, you say? With a hundred bits? Thank you, Chloe. <laughs> I felt like something was going to happen there. But much appreciated, Chloe. I don't know, I just like bits more than anything else. Because it's just more interactive. Like, people can just send like one penny to you, and then the alert pops up. It lied to you, you said you're bad, you feel scammed. Yeah, you should have a badge. Yeah. I don't know why it didn't pop up for you. The other people that send me bits. They have a badge. It should change for you. Let's go. I don't know how it did it change for you then, but yeah. You can only have three badges when you text in chat. But the badge that Chloe has right now should have changed to the one I customized. Last thing I need now. Yeah. I don't have it on the default ones. Time to spare. For the bits. Damn it. You okay? Hey, we can't Welcome you. back, Yuki. Onward. Hmm. Yep. No, she's not the leader of bits on my channel. It's her other friend, Yoni. Oni? Oni? Yeah, Oni. Oni's the leader of the bits. Only the bits leader on my channel. Oh, are you talking about on my chat right now? Oh yeah, because I haven't actually set that up properly. It's only weekly bits leader. So yeah, close the leader of the, the weekly one. But all time would be only. Yeah, on default it's weekly. Uh, take a guess, Chloe. I think you would get it. He usually drops the same amount of bits all the time on your channel whenever I see him drop it. This is favorite numbers. We 
where to now? <laughs> you got it. It was actually 666. And yeah, you're tied now. But again, thank you so much, Glow. I thought you would be more um, tied up to talking to your friend Flynn right now. You actually played the Factorio off stream as well, because I know that you was playing it on stream. Back to it. Right. No one gives a shit, so I play whatever, whenever. I mean, that's always been your thing though, Chloe. Every time you come to stream, you just play whatever you play, and then if you have your friends available, you play whatever they want to play. I mean, that's always been your lingo, so. Let's move. Oh, yeah. Some story stuff you tried to do off stream? Yes, Sniper Elite's cool. Yeah, I try to play games that I'm interested in off stream as well, which I'm trying to get more time to, but I get so distracted when other people stream, so I stay too long into people's stream and I don't do anything I can do off stream, which I'm trying to change. I want to play more games off stream. Oh, I always come by to your stream, Chloe. Let's clean up I always work. come by. But I still get distracted by other streams as well. So I probably have to cut down by hanging out on other streams. But I think I would most likely stick by your stream. Probably one of the most though. I come like in between your 20s. Like, I don't stop after it. I still see it. I still check it out. Time to boogie. Uh. Sorry, there's a fly. Yeah, I do see that as well when you guys are doing the normal rank. That's why the streams are much more longer with Rocket League. You guys go over one hour. And on we go. Yep. But yeah, like while you're streaming, there's other streamers stream at the same time, so sometimes they get very distracted, so I don't say much. But I'm still there. This is a dead end. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, it's one of those things whereby I want to start doing more stuff off stream, try and just focus on other stuff. But at the same time, I know that I still always check on Gentlemen, your streams. Do we go in? Either way.
It's open. Let's hit it. Defeat the monster. Eat well within. All right, third dungeon. Here we go. Oh, here's the goggles. What do we have here? Ancient Dragon Tooth. Alright. There's two of them now. Can I suck both of them? Let's go for it. Yo, we got both of them. What's going on, fairy? Your cam froze while you were sleeping. You actually um, have your cam on while you sleep. Say your prayers. He <laughs> didn't know. There's a market for that on Twitch though. You can actually have a sleep stream on Twitch. People will watch you sleep. Yeah. <laughs> They're pretty funny because like you just spam a lot of sounds on the streamer that's sleeping so they don't get any sleep anyway. Just to see their reaction. I mean, I wouldn't do it, but the big streamers that do it, they get a lot of donations around doing that. You can share us the pick. Cannonball for me. Camp's not gonna cut it tonight. Yeah. You thought during the stream, you didn't have an active chat. But it went viral when he woke up, he had 6k followers. Nice! No use hanging around here. Indeed. That's pretty cool. I see the, the Pepsi Max <laughs> on the table, yeah. You talking about your cat? She wasn't there. Oh, okay. Say your prayers. There's no room to swim ashore here. 
But for real though, like, I think sleeping streams are hilarious, but I would never do it on my side. It's just goofy. You know what, I'm gonna hold onto this armager. We needn't waste more time. This car going worth it. You're the Grand Chamberlain, what's this? Only exclusive for Ignis. Automatic uses an elixir when the party leader's maximum HP falls to half. Oh shit. What do you think of that emote, Barry, by the way? That was the only one I had for the moving animation emote that I can unlock. To the left, middle one. Let's go here. Say your prayers. Okay, let's get this guy to move over here. Oh. Forget this guy. All right, we'll go over here. Attack this guy instead. Let's go. Yep. Potion. Just one skeleton, really? Then there was four. Wow, 90k on Noctis on the experience. 10 more k left you until we get 100k, which we won't. Because there's a camp here, I want to use the camp. Organics? What do we have here? Organics. Organics is 248. <laughs> Actually, lower. It's getting lower now. We had Vigilantes in the dungeon before, and that's gone down to 248. Enhancing most real attributes. Oh, so we can see for organics here, all the elementals is buffed up. Spirit, strength, yeah, it goes up when you use it. Let's try it out. And again, rents comes the night, let's shine the light. All of these are poetry. Your king must not avert his eyes from what's ahead. It's about the king. King Wait, Noctis. Are we seriously sleeping here? You see a better place. Okay. Um, so where is my XP boost? I just have to look for that 
big sandwich again. Multi meat sandwich. Oh, we can't get any more. No more ham. <laughs> We're out of ham. Alright, we'll find something else to get instead. This one. Let's go over the multi meat sandwich. 20% on the XP boost. Better than nothing. So we can't do 50% or 100% anymore. Is this Laura Croft? That's Laura Croft. Well, okay. We got a couple of pictures from Laura Croft in the past, but I didn't think she was going to be standing there in the dungeon like that. Yo, Jimbo. Hey, this one's pretty good. I know. I dig it too. Prompto. I did Prompto like behind there. Which was, so was it Noctis that took this picture here? Perfect timing. <laughs> Stylish as always. Come now, it's nothing special. Hashtags. Sorry, not sorry for the selfie there by Prompto. Ready for more? You bet. Let's hit it. Let's do this. Okay. Alright, I'm in sure. Let's go. Okay, splendid building stone. Switch over to our daggers. Ziggy rat. You should be proud you gave it all. I got say your prayers. <laughs> He's got nothing left. That came out so late as well. The voice line. That should have happened after we killed him. <laughs> and it took like what an extra five seconds delay for it to trigger that. Between Noctis and Gladiator. All right, overall time. How does the ring work against this guy? Is it good? No, it's way too slow. Okay, we got them poison. Point five. Last thing I need now. I spilled it. Not closed. Get back. The beautiful bottle. Oh, it's two of them now this time. Can I suck them up in my ring? Okay, one is down. Oh, Ron stasis mode, you can still parry. So you can parry without needing any MP. Okay, I'm gonna take the left pass first again. We're alive. Let's celebrate by eating something dead. 
that voice line only gets triggered if it's an actual hard fight. Which we are actually over level pitting these guys here. Game gonna buggy by the variation of the voice lines. Alright. Yeah, no problem. Thank you for the luck, fairy. I speak soon. Bro, how did I even go? <laughs> nice, I like. <laughs> I'll take it though. Lavender oil. Um, lavender oil. A keen oil that soothes troubled minds. Okay, so this is more magic stuff. What would be like the best magic build to give to Noctis once we go with it? We've been getting a lot of spirits and other accessories that enhance magic, but I've never actually done an, a legit magic build onto him. Okay, so... Yeah, so this is going to be the middle path here. What's that on his? Is that his heart? What was that? It was like something red and glowing beneath his name. Celebrate by eating something dead. Prompto said that three times now in the space of ten minutes. Yeah, this has to be the final boss part, right? No. It's just that there's no enemies triggering here. Okay. <sighs> Cold. Yeah. So it's the dead end on the mid path as well. So the lost path away to take is the right path. Go. Uh, I think I could handle this all by myself. Titanium Bangle! Is that let's the one go. I need? <laughs> Titanium Bangle? Um, let's see. Centurion Bangle, Titanium. Oh, Titanium's less than compared to Centurion. Oh no, it's the Platinum Bangle. Right? Platinum Bangle is the best one to grab for HP. Shall we? Okay. Okay, so this guy is just a normal guy. Okay, the final boss. So that goes really slow for this guy here. So these daggers ain't that great in the air. Um, let's see now. Right. Nope. I'm gonna grab onto a higher bar. No. It wants me to drop on the ground really quickly when I actually use the daggers. Okay, he's on the ground now. Be nice to break things up in here. Diamond bracelet. 
Let's try this. This is low as well on the diamond. Increases maximum HP mildly. Okay, Titan, titanium bundles kind of crap. Then diamond bracelet considerably. Or could we give it to someone else for the diamond? So we got Magitek shield. Let's try out Prompto. Oh, they're both bad. Temper shield is better. The HP increase. Sounds like someone's in a good mood. All right, Let's grab these guys up the ring. My potion. No use hanging around here. Indeed. Damn. This holy. <laughs> it's too strong, holy. Mega potion. Again, I don't like the whole. You have to dodge to actually activate holy. Would have been better if it was just a press of a button. Okay, you're done. We have an ether in this ground here. <laughs> We're alive. Let's celebrate by eating something dead. Prompto. He just he said this five times now. This doesn't look too good. Alright, what level we got here? 73. Chunky. Chunky little guy. Chunkiest iron guy we'll ever fight. Let me grab which one do we want to grab here? Let's grab a high elixir on Noctis. Hey, All we got. Yeah, the the daggers aren't good for the aerial. Strikes at all. But if I change a different weapon, oh, never mind. Oh, let's go the cross chain. Cross chain is definitely what is best for me in this game. All right, Gladia. Uh, he's got resistant on that, on the big swords. Almost close to Armager. Okay, here it goes. This will get us to at least two tech bars. That's great. <laughs> Just like soften up his um, hand there. Oh, he's vulnerable, but there was no cross chain activated when he was in that vulnerable stage. Let's actually wrap up behind him now. Yeah. 
That's just one swing there. Oh, we've got him poisoned. Hi, oh, Ignis. With everything we have. Pronto. Look alive. Oh, it's a bit more. I'm not gonna let him grab me though. No way. Okay, so all of our guys are over 50k experience. Nice, nice, nice. We get the enhancer here. And again, Propto. Let's celebrate by eating something dead. Let's eat everything now here. Alright. So this one's at 364. Still the ultimate sword. Now, enhancer, the hop is no special powers. This one-handed sword is valued for its Unsurpassed attack strength. What attack strength is still weaker than Ultimate Blade? With Ultimate Blade, you get plus 40 and 30 on those stats. Enhancer, you only get plus 12. But I'll just swap it to Enhancer to see if there's anything in terms of its design that's different. It looks kind of different there. Reminds me of like an Edge Maverick sword over at Star Ocean by design. So now we got five more to go. Of the dungeons. 234 AP. Alright, let's return back to the entrance. Not bad though. So far, with all these dungeons, despite the fact that these three dungeons have the same similar puzzle sequence. <sighs> I'm done. <sighs> Let's go back to the car, and then I'm gonna go rest up at um, Golden Key for the double XP. Safe and sound. No mistake in the smell of. So we do that, rest up, level up a bit more, and then we're going to go for that fourth dungeon. Every time we defeat the final boss in the dungeon, we grab... A new weapon. It should be a nice change. It benefits of pace. for Ignis, Prompto, and Gladio. But for Noctis, with that one sword we have now, the Enhancer, didn't benefit him too much. I should do this more often when I get to ki Oh, we can't. Okay. I wanted to kind of cheat and use my chocobo to run over here to the cafe place, but nope. <laughs> it just refuses. Oh well. Welcome to Golden Key. Welcome, welcome. Golden Key. <sighs> Man, it's hot. Then lose the jacket. Will you be staying the night with us? Experience. Two times the experience. Ugh, I'm all sticky and gross. We got two levels. With Noctis to 93. 
Everyone's at 88. How much is that difference? That's a 5 difference in terms of level. Because we got that Moogle chop. <laughs> Nailed it. This should be a hit. So we can see that decoy in the warp to the right. It's nice and detailed there as well. We bamboozled this guy. The gang's all here, see? Us? Yeah, but you put it you took the picture in like the worst time possible because like can't even see Noctus there. Stylish as always. Come now, it's nothing special. Striking a pose. Quit it. Oh yeah, you can see Noctus there at the top fighting the guy. Perfect timing. <laughs> so the rest of these fellows are with the big guy here. Stylish as always. Fair enough. Better make tracks. Chop chop, Prompto. There in a jiffy. Alright, let's return to the car and see what is our next dungeon to go to. Alright. Kodesh time, and it's now gonna be in Durel. So, this one. Who's this one again? Well, I'm gonna go there anyway. Oh, yeah, I need to quick save. So, I'll quick save here. Mm, where can we pop ourselves fast? Mm, let's see. You know what? I'm just gonna let it drive. In order. Yep. All right. It's not that far anyway. Mm. Uh, put some Final Fantasy Type Zero soundtrack. This is the last one we unlocked in the soundtrack. Million fire. I right, skip that one. Skip this one. Oh, now he changed to the city of 012. But yeah, that covers all of that. When the last time we actually did use Type Zero. Um. Oh, so if we hold it, it changes the soundtrack complete, so we don't need to tap it. All right. This is much better to find where I need to go to. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's go to twelve. There we go. Oh, this is the original boss theme. I like Zodiac's Age boss themes, which wasn't included in this game. But yeah, ever since um, Final Fantasy X, they've had the same arrangements to the boss themes for 12, 13, 15, and now 16. I was listening to the 16th boss theme, it was like exactly like how Final Fantasy X's boss theme has been. Slight arrangement, but still catches that boss theme from 10. So, Nox, haven't taken pics at whatever catches my eye, but what do you want to see? Give me Ignis. Get some more shots of specs. <sighs> gotcha. I'll see what I can do. Prompto, take more pictures of Ignis until resting again. Lovely. What's coming through the road? Oh, it's these snake thingies. It's 
snake centipedes. Alright, we've got 0 0.29 miles to go. For the time being, we'll just yank up as much XP and AP the game gives us. Which isn't much. But hey. Better than nothing with no AP while riding around this car. Still a bit of a walk from here. Wait, they want they wanna park here? Really? Okay, oh, all right, so how do we traverse up here? Should we just keep them going? Oh, well, we just use the chocobo and get around there, isn't it? Yeah, all right. Easy now. This baffles me every time that they have like the best car, they park in some random place and they come back and it's always 100% as where it left up from before. Oh, nice here. Yeah. We'll meet again. Nothing here. Diamond bracelet. It finally popped up. The diamond bracelet. I remember coming to this place and it didn't pop up, and now it does. I got a second diamond bracelet. I tried to get it earlier before. But this is one of the best weapons for strength, the diamond bracelet. And by the way, how does this um, work though? So I just want to check something. So if I go into Noctis, and then I click on diamond bracelet. How much is tied onto this? Or oh, oh, I see. So it's not like you have many times of the same item. They just separate it. So it's always done by whenever you collect it. All right. So we've probably got a couple more. But yeah, this was one of the areas that's found in the game that you can grab. That's actually a good accessory for layer one. So that walkthrough I saw must have been something whereby you actually look at the walkthrough after you complete the main story and then it actually pops up. This is the stuff I need for the Adamantus quest when I get to it. I'm going on ahead. Okay. Alright, so fourth dungeon time. What do we have in store? Gonna be the same puzzle? What do we have? What are we gonna have? Is this the one whereby we have to Thanks kick down the, the stairs of the ladders oh, in this thanks, dungeon? Buddy. This was one of the hidden ones that it didn't actually have a royal yeah. arm inside. Try not to get yeah, lost. yeah, this is the one. Don't yeah. Lost. Pitch black in here. What's that? Okay, let's parry. Oh, damn. Throw that the worst convenient moment there. Okay, overwhelmed. Ignis! Where are you, Ignis? Alright, Gladio. You go instead. We're in the home stretch. Nice work, Gladio. Well played, alright. And on we go. Yep. Let us proceed. Oh, we should use our armager here. Oh, but they're level 20. Ooh, 
Oh, that took about 50% of a Mia. Yeah, that was strange. We got a weird combination, the Hector Eyes along with the Iron Giant. Oh, we're confused. I was like, I'm trying to roll forward and now I just realize I'm confused. Um, we'll just wait for three tech bars for Gladia. Alright, Gladia. Nice. Okay, so we have to climb up on one of these ladders here. And then that will reach us to the club platform. And... That will get us to where we want to be. For that secret dungeon area. Let's clean them up quick. Let's get the three tech bars here. The gladiator to clean up. Here I am. Gladiator. Ooh, these guys are super low. Oh, we're using the ring. Okay. Well, we're done. Now then. We can climb up here. Saves us the time to go all the way around. Alrighty, so from here... Let's follow this path. Okay, let's proceed. What do we have here? Oh shit, let <laughs> me drop. What do we have here? Hello, Charlotte. Yeah. What now? An ominite fossil. Yeah, so this is the way we need to go. Um, over there. But how do we get over there? That's what I was trying to figure out last time. Because we need to go underneath then. That's where the dungeon is. Um, yeah, and we can't actually warp. Just by pressing the Y button there. Alright. Find a different way, I guess. Yeah, because even this one. Oh. This is another one that we need to tuck in. What is it? Is there, is there like a ladder here? No. It's only pointing to this ladder here. This is where it was before. I don't know. We just have to try and find a way to get to that side. This is to use the armager on the leeches. No need for these guys. Point warfare. And on we go. Right. I potion.
Let's go left pathway here. Oh yeah, there was a fishing spot over there. Um, <sighs> we're not gonna fish. Wow. <laughs> He's vulnerable, but I'm not gonna use my cross chain on him. Finish out right now. Let's do this. Right. Wow. Um, is my Phoenix. Pay attention, Iggy. Gotcha. What the? I think that's one of their moves though. Leech is one of their moves is death. Once they touch you, you just automatically die. No matter what level you are. Plus they can turn you into stone. I'll give you that. How many times? It's the samurai dudes at level seventeen. They're not menacing at all at this level. Um, no, we don't use the homage on these guys, even though they're annoying. Oh, Mr. Parry! You have to roll backwards. Darn it, not. Why did you roll backwards, dude? Shit. Everyone's confused. Let's do it the hard way then. Just walk into them. So everyone can gather confusion. Oh, Prompto. My man. So I can get rid of these eyeball guys. Good proppy Prompto. You're a good puppy. Oh. oh my god, I <laughs> dropped down there again. Yikes. Yeah, because that feels like the only way to get up there. Well, should I cycle to the right? Maybe there is a pathway to the right that I did not see. Instead of actually going left, let's go right. On this side. And if we hug up a certain pathway, we will be able to get to a new path. Because that pathway to the left only leads up to that left pathway, and... Yeah, I don't think we've actually explored everything to the right side, so we'll try again. This time to the right. Oh, it must... It's the flashing light that gets me dizzy. Oh... Back to it. Right. Hmm. Yeah, I wanted to go this way. Yeah. There's two ladders there. It says there's two ladders. Two ladders in this section.
Is this going to the entrance part? From where I'm leading off to. This is not whereby I went from the last part, but whatever. Yeah, we'll see. Yeah. So, 17 samurai here. Oh, this time he wasn't staggered by me. Say your prayers. Yeah. Rusted bit. I've been collecting a rusted bit in a long time. But hey, now's now. With a rusted bit. Alright, let's, let's slide for This is leading back to the entrance, right? Yeah. This is leading right back to the entrance if we keep on going this way out, yeah. Alright, let's start this over again then. When we actually go all the way down to the end, we're going to turn it right. And from that right, we're going to find a new pathway that will lead us to those that place we need to be. So I keep on screwing this over. Alright, so the monsters won't respawn it because we've cleaned house with them right now. Just have to run to the direction we need to go to. Oh, and here comes the glitch again. <laughs> it always happened in that same direction. Wow, wow, wow. Alright, let's move on to the right here. Now then. This is the way to get up and 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 up. Um, no, there's no way to get through there anyway. Alright. Oh, yes, yeah, so this was the pathway last time to get actually get up to the entrance. Yeah. Dawn. Oh, Dawn. This sucks. So the only real pathway to go is for the left. Okay. Alright, let's try again and find something. So, fishies over that way. Huh. And then there's a ladder above. Alright, we can't jump over here. How about to the this pathway? This right pathway here. No? Alright, back on to this ladder again. As this is the only way to get up here. Oh man. 
So is there anything here that I can grab? Touch. No. Yeah, because there's a ladder down there, right here. Uh, but we can only follow this path. If we drop down here, then we're back to the ground. If I can't do this again, then I'm just going to head over to the Colosseum. Because the lights are showing here. Oh man. No opportunity to grab it or get over there. And then we hit the dead end here. Can't warp over there. What does the game want me to do to get there? Let's investigate. Hello Benji. The only way to reach is in a fight. So the only way I can actually get to that secret dungeon is... Damn. I guess what I can just do is just reset this place so I can just go out and go back in. And then just avoid the enemies here. Yeah, because I need to get there. That's the only way to get into that dungeon area. I have to be up there when it ends. Alright. Okay, so this is the way to get to the entrance. If I just leave the entrance and just get out of the dungeon and then just run back in. I should reset the monsters and just get them respawned. But it's kind of weird though that they actually allowed the game to play that way, whereby I have to be in a fight with the monsters there. Let the boys finish the fight. Alright. I mean, I got my ring as well. It's got range. But if I use my ring, then they don't actually fight as well, do they? Oh no, let's just see anyway. As long as you're still up there at the end of the fight, because you have to load the yeah, ladder. Don't get used to it. Why is everything such a big deal with you? Let him have his fun while he's still alive. <laughs> uh, I'll still stay up there. Switch to the ring. Now let's see if this triggers the monsters here. No, it hasn't triggered it.
What's the closest camp? There's no camp here. Oh yeah, save and reload game. And then going after his gotcha. Okay, yep, they all respawned. Wow. This, is like a real life this is the only tricky one? Okay. Alright, time to overwhelm. Oh shit. Got me. Yeah. Oh, you got me, and after to actually plant a phoenix on me. Oh, okay. One down, two down. All right. So I know we slide down here and then there's monsters at the bottom here. I can just ignore them and keep them running. We'll see how big the monster field so I can actually warp. These guys are here. Yeah, I can beat these guys up. Yeah, I'd have to warp up there. Yeah, every time in this area, my game glitches up, I can't slide, and then it's funny slides. So from here. Oh, there it is. Well, I just wanna walk on this guy here. Yeah, I should just beat him up. Beat all these guys up. And then, once he does that, um, before he does that, then I should walk up, yeah. That's what I do. I won't use any heck points, I'm just gonna keep my hand just like this. I can met oh shit, this is going fast. Damn, his health was going really fast there. No! We all good. What? Good to go. Bro, alright, I have to have to restart that. First time I did it, it landed on the, the platform. Second time, he rode off. Next time, face the wall. Misses on these necromancers down there. Oh. It's 
like a certain percentage chance if it does hit or doesn't hit. The second one. Watch yourself, I know. Oh, I should have just went with the giant first. And I'm dizzy as well. You're out. Okay, that's great. Well, at least that's done. Dungeon number four. In. I've already done three dungeons so far, but there hasn't been any real difference. Except for some level changes. Just what are you up to? Yeah, they do get harder, yeah. Based on the levels, this is the fourth one up. Switch the ring. Remember, just a small boss. Easy as they come. That's crossing the line. Sorry. What do we have here? Beautiful bottle. No use hanging around here. Indeed. Really? Again? There you go. The base silver piece. If I just like mash the, the roll button here, can we get holy out? Or we'll just hold it. We're actually maximizing the damage as well for holy. But if we do it, let's do it this way. Okay, what do we need to pick up now? What's this? Beetle shell. Alright. The hunt is on. Oh, they got so vulnerable there. Help. 
Ah, let's use Armager. The health regeneration is not that much when using the ring that way. Alright, Gladio. Any last words? Okay, we got the break on this guy. And you are done. Strong pincers. Put it in the box. It's history now. And high potion. All right. What's the next one? More crabs? Oh, more of these guys. Makes it easier with so much characters coming in the ground. Don't need to stock up or buy more. How many times? Enough talk. Time for some action. Say your prayers. Okay, we got this guy poisoned. And we got him to the ground now. Oh, this is resistant. What the daggers? Come on, boys. What do we have here? Shield Shears Claw. Onward. Mega Elixir yeah. now. Damn! Not again! Going for it. Uh -huh. Ooh, let's go! Showtime, you say? Alright, let's grab that high elixir. Ignis. Was that perfect or what? I'll give you that. What did we pick up? Mega potion. I'm going all out. Just don't oh, this guy. I haven't fought you in a really long time. 85 now. The Malboros. We got chopped up twice there. Oh, you got me. I'm gonna wait for the two heck bar, and then we'll just grab it with uh, Ignis. Oh, Ignis is in danger. Uh, hold on. Which one do we need? Mega Elixir. Oh, he's vulnerable. Alright, Gladio. This is all yours. 9999999999. Yeah. <laughs> What's next we got? 
Oh, that's going up. Sounds like someone's in a good mood. Basking in our hard-fought victory, I presume. I just want the poison to rear away. There we go. Oh, gone. Onward, right. Yeah, I'm no longer hyped about whatever item we grab in that middle. It's only the time at the end to see what weapon we get. <gasps> it's the Moogle Charm. Moogle Charm. We got another Moogle Charm here. Sixteen, sixteen, and sixteen. <laughs> uh, I might as well do this right now. If I equip two Moogle Tribes on Noctis, that's one. Do we get two of them at the same time? We do it like that. And then, which is the one that was given for Gladius? So, where's Gladius one? Gladio, Gladio. One's the Gladius. Gladius, Gladius. Exclusive to Ignis. Gladio. Black Belt. Let's go with this one. And then, one that's exclusive to Ignis. It's this one. That sounds cool. Elixir. For now. And then one that's exclusive to Prompto. Where is it? Which is the one that's actually exclusive to Prompto? This one? Eminent infused with the power of the loose side increases Prompto's critical hit rate. I guess so. This is the one. <sighs> Alright. <sighs> Let's read this before camping. Uh, would I live a life of bliss? Oh, that's just it for that. All right, let's camp out. Wait, are we seriously sleeping here? You see a better place? Hell yeah, this is where we're sleeping. Last stand. All right. Um, where's the XP? I just want to grab it real quick. XP, XP, XP. Where's the XP one? HP, attack boost. Where is you XP? There we go. 30%. Hey, isn't that... Isn't what what? Just my imagination. Yeah. It's just your imagination, Noctis. I likes. Quit it. You. <laughs> It's really squiggly up close. It looks very gooey. Let's say that. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, 
custard. Next up is gonna be mayonnaise when you see those guys. Nothing to it. How many can we get sucked in here? Holy crap! Again! Alright, Gladia. Break these shells. For me? Break him all down. Ooh, look at them breaks. Alright, Prompter. Bum, 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 bum. Good job. Let's get wrap around to the back here. Oops. Was that perfect or what? I'll give you that. An ancient <laughs> dragon tooth. Again, I shouldn't be surprised. <clears throat> Alright, let's go for the store. Oh yeah, let's go with the armager here. Let's go. Yeah, where's Ignis? Alright, Prompter. Prompter's the only one here. Yeah, I had to dodge there really good. Oh, Harry. Alright, Prompter. Seven seven three. Nice one, Pronto. There's my blind side. Blind side, come on. Give me my blind side. Alright. Since you're here, Ignis, let's finish it together. Let every one of the boys finish together. Can't stop not. What can I say? I think I'm finally starting to get the hang of this. Mega potion. Uh, do you mean it? I mean, really? Right. Do you mean it? All right, custard. I haven't had custard in a really long time. Splendid building stone. And that is what I call a dead end. So let's head back up and take the next path. Alright, one more door to go through. Okay, so next one is this middle path here. Will this be another dead end, or will this be the way to go? We'll shall see. Oh, it's Sir Tonberry. Damn.
All right, overwhelm this guy. No quarter. No mercy. Yeah, because this guy moves around so much, Gladio must have not been able to get his hits in when he charges up his weapon. Here comes the blind side. Oh, Ignis. Now's our chance. Come on, on its last legs. Let's get it out of its misery. Boom. Must say, I'm amazed. What can I say? Yeah, the extra Moogle charm is coming in really good. Noctis is nearly dead. at 60k XP, while the other is at 45. Elixir. Got a lightning quest there. Let's clean him up quick. Eyes forward. Oh, sorry about that. Yeah. The beautiful bottle. Must have said that like what six times now today? Beautiful bottle. <laughs> Let's move. Yeah. That's one of them down. I want to grab um, Gladios for the break and the high damage. So close to get Gladio now. Woo! Alright, Gladio. All right, next up. Ah, oh, another sudden tonberry. Oh, good, good job, tonberry. I just slided through for another. Line cycling. Save me the hassle to get behind you there. Wait, what happened? Is this the second one? Or yeah, what happened to it? He just recovered all his health. I think he just recovered all of his health there. Whatever, I'm gonna use Armager right now. Yay! 
Yo, Kit Kat with the raid? What's up, Kit Kat? How was uh, Final Fantasy 16, buddy? He told us to give you the bang. <laughs> What's up, Savvy? What's up, Ganga? How you guys doing? What's up, uh, Fatty Kit Kat? I deserve the bang, don't I? Yo, Sammy, thank you for the follow, dude. Much appreciated. I don't think Kit Kat's ever told me what the bang is, but <laughs> it's just like you just have the attach you've just given me the, the gunshot there. But yeah, I, I get the bang I deserve. But yeah, how did um, Final Fantasy 16 go for you, Kit Kat? We're alive. Let's celebrate by eating something dead. Oh my god, Punto, that same voice line keeps us saying that every two minutes. One shot. Oh no problem, dude. Like um, whenever I'm free, I definitely check out your streams, Kit Kat. Always fun to watch. I mean I don't even mind getting spoiled by Final Fantasy 16, because I know you can be streaming that. For the next couple of weeks. All right, someone topped uh, Prompto up. There was really so much cool stuff that happened. Some spoiler stuff. Yeah. All right, Gladio. Glad to hear though that you've actually got some cool stuff going through. You should have played nothing else until you finish it. Same thing, me, me and Cat Cat's the same. We always just play the same game until we finish it. I like doing that as well. I don't really like to mix around with the games, but yeah. As soon as I finish what I need to do, that's what I'll be doing. At least until he plays more combat. True, yeah. He's already got the game pre-ordered. It's kind of a shame though, because Kit Kat was trying to get the... Um, access for uh, was it the online yesterday or earlier today it came out which he wasn't able to get but the other more combat partners was able to play online for the early access but hey if I get the game early as well who knows me against Kit Kat more combat one that'll be interesting to see too close for comfort I'm comfortable just being alive You trying to get the online stress test yesterday? Go on for free during MK11. But this time, they didn't give you. Damn. Yeah, because I saw um, Destroyer FGC playing it. He's a really big um, content creator for MK. <laughs> JC trust me already, you're not good. You just chill. Yeah, I mean it'll be like a chill match to be honest. I don't mind. Like nothing will be up for grabs anyway, it'll just be for fun. Just to play some MK with you. That'd be great. That'd be great for fun. Any last words? Some collab would be great. Yeah, exactly. The collab would be fire if we actually did the collab together, Kit Kat. I'd love to do that. Because with MK11, that had crossplay online. So PC and PS5 should be good. All right, Kit Kat. Have a good one, dude. He's got a knife. But yeah, if you're gonna be streaming tomorrow as well for Final Fantasy 16, I'll be there. Get lost. Good. Oh, yeah. oh, hi there, opening. <laughs> nice one, Procto. Get out. See ya. Yep, right, got it. Alright. 
No more messing around now. We're loading this guy up with the armager. Bro's vulnerable right now. That's that home stretch. All of our boys are over 100k on XP. That's guaranteed to level up. But. Again, dude. <laughs> he wants to eat something dead again. Prompto, stop that. <laughs> How long does this take to finish this game? Usually, seems like a huge game. Um, right now, Gengar, I'm actually doing a, like a hundred percent run on Final Fantasy 15. So this game could be actually completed around 30 to 40 hours. Main story rise. I've done like over a hundred hours on this game for the past month. Um, so I have no idea whereby. How many hours I have left to finish this? But yeah, it's a big game. Let's do this. Right. Yeah, Jenny, I just like to go with most of the side quest parts of this game rather than go for the main story, which I have done. <laughs> Damn, we're on that grind. <laughs> yeah, I've had this plan whereby I wanted to do Final Fantasy 15 for the whole month of June, and I kind of stuck with it. Game's a whole lot of fun when you actually focus on the side quests and everything else but the main story. That's what I love about Final Fantasy 15. It's just massive. How many times? Enough talk. Time for some action. <laughs> The Tom Berry's over there, guys. Got a tough one on our hands. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, let's 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 go after the boys. Nothing goes. Now, I don't know what is the difference with the different colors of the enemy. So, some of the enemies have purple for the health, and then some of them have yellow. As for as like, oh, they might actually be weak to magic if they're purple. But I've actually used some magic on these enemies with purple health, and it doesn't really do anything, actually, at all. <laughs> Gladio! You never see Gladio get taken down. Gladio's got max health for me right now. <laughs> Alright, let's go for another overall. One last stretch right now. Oh, another dead end. Alright. Alright, back up we go. We've got one more path to go, which is the first right. Let's celebrate by eating something dead. Oh sure, Sprompto. It's like he wants to eat everything going up that's dead. <laughs> Watching me play Final Fantasy is making me wanna get back to my Stranger of Paradise. Oh, I remember Stranger of Paradise. I haven't actually gone around to playing that because that's been on my backlog as well. Stranger Paradise and Final Fantasy Type-0, that's one Final Fantasy game that I forgot to play. But yeah, it's all a lot of fun Final Fantasy games. Because I think Stranger Paradise is uh, the guy that talks about death all the time in the trailers. He looks like Core from this game, the general. He has like a, another group of guys fighting with him, which Final Fantasy's had that same trend now for the past Final Fantasy games. We're here. Okay, so this must be it then. To go through. Oh yeah, this is the right way to go. Jew Cold. What's this? 
370. How much is Gladios? 581. 370. Damn. It's not even that much. You've been hooked on Destiny 2 lately. You haven't made progress on your Final Fantasy. Yeah, Destiny 2 can be quite a burner, really. A lot of people I know play that game. And they played it for like five to six years with their clans. So you can that definitely get hooked onto gross. Destiny 2 for a long time. Five percent of your friends are fans of Final Fantasy, and you've never played Final Fantasy. They keep on trying to convince you. I mean, do you play any JRPGs or RPGs in general? That might be it. If you're like a person that plays a lot of RPGs, then it's going to be hard to convince you to actually jump on Final Fantasy. Ninety-five to ninety-one. All right. Yeah, I know. Why you gotta be so photogenic? He was one of those kids that started Look FPS games, so never got the chance to. Yeah, I started with a lot of action games, FPS games, platforming games when I was growing yeah. up. But then something clicked with me years later, and then once I started playing some RPGs, well, I've just played more. The closest JRPG you ever played is Yakuza. Yeah, Yakuza's great. Yakuza is the spiritual successor to a game called Shenmue on the Dreamcast. Ready for more? And you bet. it's doing way better than Shenmue right now because I remember Shenmue 3 came out and people didn't like how that turned out despite waiting for so many years for that game to come out. But Yakuza's doing really good. A lot of people Shoot like that game, those series. Damn, I didn't even hit him, but he executed his little parry there. Alright, we got our blind side leg. Let's go. Alright, let's go for the Elm Rob. You love Lacusa, never play Shenmue, but you've seen a lot of memes of it. Yeah! <laughs> Shenmue was special in the beginning because it was one of the highest budget game ever made back then because of how much people was involved with the voice acting. So there's some really funny cutscenes in that game. Yeah, because I've only played most of Shenmue 1. I still have Shenmue 2 on my Xbox. Never going around to playing that. And then Shenmue 3 came out like, what, 20 years later? But yeah, Yakuza started off around after Shenmue 2, so on the PS2. And it's just been making games ever since. I think it's like the second or third highest grossing game series for Sega after Sonic and Persona. Yeah. It's done really well because a lot of the fans in the beginning had to get their copies overseas and then on the PS3 they started localizing their games and that's what got their popularity started off with the Yakuza series. Wait wait what? This is invulnerable. Wait 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 Yeah everything right now is invulnerable. Okay, I have to finish this. Go in. I'll just use the ring then. Physical wise, it's not actually working at all. You played Zero and K Kirami One, but you plan to play the rest of them in order. Yeah, that'll be good to play the rest of them in order, because they also have remakes, right, of the Accuser games coming out like bit by bit. So the 
remasters or remakes of one and two. I think that is the one you just mentioned, isn't it, Kiwami? Is that a remake of one, perhaps or two? But yeah, I, I knew uh, that those PS2 games are just getting remaked for the PS4, now. and they're going in order that way. The ones that, yeah. This take Which is great that they're doing that for the fans that missed out on it. Baddy B, baddy boom, all done. Mega potion, let's go. One and two got a remake, which is nice, so they have to play the older one. Yeah. And who knows about the older ones, like in terms of the technology of playing the game now. Like you get a, probably a better experience playing the remakes because they're going to be set on the current engines of the games. It's much more better to play that way with a modern engine. Everything cool? No problems here. Ignis, don't be late. Don't be late. Oh, Noctis. No, not Noctis. Uh, Prompto. I'm trying to call out Prompto here. There you go. Oh, hi there, opening. No. All right, kitty cat, time to sleep. Oh yeah. Yeah, since the swords are invulnerable, I'm just gonna use the ring. Aoife. Okay, let's dodge. <laughs> Ignis, if I may. I can just keep on holding V here. He's never going to get himself counted at this point. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a loop whereby you keep on staggering him. And he won't be able to get out and counter it. No problem, Gengar. But yeah, thank you for joining the raid from KitKat. You know, much appreciated. But yeah, speak soon and take care. Wouldn't expect any less. Oh, hi there, opening. Have a good one, Gengar. Okay, so this is the big boss here. No, it's not. No, I thought it was. Okay, I'm gonna go with the armager first. Damn, where's my parry at? Again! Where's my parry? Where's my parry game? Oh, this guy is, has had enough. Oh, so this is the increased damage here. Yeah? Oh, we got a parry there. Nice. 
Oh shit. Uh, let me just heal up. Oh, so that is a move that goes all the way around. Shit. <laughs> Big laser beam. Hi, right, Prompter. <laughs> is he gonna eat something dead again? Is he gonna say it? Oh, cool. Earring. An earring fable to have worn by an oracle of your oh increases magic significantly. Okay, cool. <laughs> I knew it. He's gonna say it. Let's celebrate by eating something dead. Of course, he's gonna say that same line. This game sounds really bugged right now. <laughs> this should take long. Yo, alright. Let's play the high here. potion. Let's go. Indeed. There we go. Boss time. Oh shit. Okay, we can get out of here. It's not gonna stop us. Oh, I hate the like the snake medusas. Just sliding around. Oh, Ignis, the person I wanted right now. All right, let me grab a remedy. Oh, no remedy. Okay, we'll just wait for Ignis to stop turning into a frog. Oh, and wait for me to. Get back to normal after being turned to stone. Alright, first of all, we just go with Gladius then. Gladius. Get a break going. Alright, and then I need to get myself a potion real quick. Yeah, Mega Elixir. Thank you, Sammy, for dropping by and um, being a part of Raid for Kit Kat. It was lovely talking to you. And yeah, catch you later. I'll speak soon. Damn, we're all froggies. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> Have a good one, Sammy. Take care. All right, let's go for the overall here. Ew. Yeah, yes, go with the parry. Prompto is stuck to stone. Once he actually gets. Okay, now we can do it. Just overroam this sneaky dude. Alright, let's go. You know, one thing I haven't had for a long time now is a summon. Where's my summon at? Shit. Damn. The time he gets vulnerable, I actually go with Overwhelm here. God oh, damn it. Overwhelm does way more than 10 seconds. So we won't be able to get a cross chain. Goodness me. Precision Lance. Alright. This is the next weapon. 
head over to Ignis. So this is 246. This one is 266. Dragoon Lance has extra elemental damage. This one is a bit more stronger. Increases the odds of landing a critical hit. Let's go. This will be good for the overwhelm when we do start striking in. Yeah, so we got some two good weapons for Ignis here. Alrighty. So, next thing, let's return to the entrance. <sighs> I'm done. Sky's opening up. Sure is. We collect beautiful bottles inside the dungeons. Damn well, we'd be collecting beautiful dungeon <laughs> bottles outside amazing. the dungeon as well. Alright. Let's so return to the car. <laughs> Alrighty, so... Yeah, we should rest up, isn't it? Yeah, we should rest up. So let's go to Golden Key and rest up. We get the two times experience. And I'm feeling for another one, actually. I'm going to probably just do another dungeon on top. So that's four dungeons cleared. We've got four more to go. But that's four dungeons cleared. So we do another one after this. And we'll see what we do next. We're going to... Or should we just do Colosseum? I think we could just do Colosseum instead. Because we haven't done anything Colosseum-wise. We've done four dungeons. but And I did say I wanted to do some Colosseum. As well. Yeah. It'd be great because I don't really want to miss out a Colosseum part for some medals. For a day. So yeah, we'll do a bit of Colosseum. That sounds good. But it's been great so far. Going with the dungeons and completing those four dungeons. And get some good weapons. And we leveled up quite a bit as well. As now we can actually do that level 99 Medusa mission at any point. We're, we're strong enough to take her out with the weapons we got. It was more probably for a strength type of difference with the weapons we've collected. Because the problem was that it took us more than, what, 8 hours to defeat Medusa in game time. And then the day comes out and we won't be able to de Rather defeat her. Yeah. Oh well, but yeah, we'll do that. Welcome to Golden Key. All good. Let's rest up. Will you be staying the night with us? So we got 96, 92, 92. Wow. Wow. Perfect timing. <laughs> <laughs> Ignis's legs looks like it's shaking here. <laughs> By the way, it looks it looks like it's shaking. <laughs> Striking a pose. Oh yeah. Okay, Colosseum time. Let's do a quick save. Alright, where's the beard? Can I actually call Umbra here? Oh, I can! <laughs> okay, cool. Let's head to Otisha. Yesterday, we did about two hours or so on Coliseum. I'll see how I do for today with it. And we are here 
in Otitia. Alright, where's the staircase? It's over here. And from traveling to Otitia, it's actually 4 o'clock. Or maybe this is the last time when I was in Otitia, it was 4 o'clock. We go back to the time whereby we last left. Which, yeah, could be. But we do now have a way to swim to Otitia with the royal ship. Oh, care to take a cruise? Which was actually fun last time, doing. So we could have um, yeah, used the royal ship from Golden Key to Otitia. It's docked there. Fantastic. Call when you need a ride back. Okay, and now we need to dock to the other area now. Splendid. Where are we off to? All right, it's been a while, but here we go. We're here, Coliseum time. Rooster, Riven, or the Scorpion, mm, or the Crab. That's the Crab. Mm, it's like a 1.8 here. Pocket tries. Oh, I see why. I'm gonna go with the Riven. Yeah, let's go with the Riven here. There's two of them, and I'm just like, hey, let's see what these guys can do together. If they just jump on the crab, or well, if everyone jumps on the crab, they, he automatically loses, right? Oh, no, Riven, don't run straight. Okay, okay, this is great. That was a good jump by the rooster there. Oh, boy. Yes, we, we've won this now. Yeah, we've definitely got this now. Good job. Damn, this cockatrice is going in. Holy shit. So the roosters have a incredible fast speed in terms of attacking. Like the actual attack rate is just massive, but I thought they would have just ganged up on the rooster. Damn, alright, so we got Reaper King against Truant. Uh, I'll just go with Truant the 1.4 odds. Alright, come on out. Let's go. Reaper King can hit the the sting. It can hit. But Truin can get him vulnerable. Cause look how close it is despite that there's an odd of 1.4 to whatever it was, 3 point something. Damn. Today. Shop, Shop every day. day. Alright, let's raid you in. Joe Horn, Jai. Yeah, this toad. <laughs> Chunky toad. Chunky toad time. Let's go. Should we go with Horn and Resolve? Cause these guys are not attacking me right now. Yeah, let's go with the... Once we get the body slam in, that's just guaranteed. Yeah, so that. That would shake up this whole health with Resolve on. And then the roadie probably finish. <clears throat> Alright, so 1-6. Let's get to 1.7 mil. 3.5, 2.8, 2.7, 1 1.4. Anak is at 3.5, and then. Oh, the jewel horns there. These guys. 
do, do these guys hit hard though? I guess I'll try. 2.8 odds on the Vesper Guardians. Let's go for it. Let's go for it. <clears throat> oh, they're going to go after the dual horn first. Oh, no. We need to heal up. Heal up, heal up, heal up. No. All right. Straight up to Nassi then. Nassi. If our guy is already dead. Oh, and that's another guy dead on our side. Arbor's down. But yeah, our guy is really low. <laughs> Annex have the best chance of winning here. Yeah, we, we just got slaughtered. Don't let it get to you. Alright, 3.5 to 4.1 and 1.7. Um, let's see. Uh, I guess I'll go to 1.7. Actually, wait. We got the dual, we got the bullets, and then maybe, maybe. Okay, I'll, I'll go with Vesper Guardians again, just because of the conditions of the other guys. Yeah, let's try this again. And the dual horns in the middle. This is great, actually. Everyone can swarm the dual horn right now. Yeah, everyone's rolling in. Everyone's going in. We just need that tenacity going right now. One of the bullets are gone though. Our guys are good help. Alright, here we go. Here comes the Tanasi. Yes! One more hit, one more hit, boys. Alright, that was a good call. And the actual enemy placement in the beginning was so great. The one with the best odds right in the middle, so you can get swarmed. Reaper King versus Red Giant. Let's go with the Red Giant here. 2.0 odds. Yeah, about 1,000. Well, 19k. Yeah, 19k. So what do we have here? Sucking him in. Reaper can't, King can't do anything there. Bam! Get staggered. Um, let's go with Corner Reserve. Corner Reserve. Oh, you missed his sword there. Okay, didn't get him staggered there. Alright, now he's vulnerable again. Pow! He's getting burned. That looks like the burn stats, right? The flames. There we go. Good win. Give me my 19k. Alright, let's rage on. 4.4, 2 2.1, 4.6. Hmm. These are Tomberries at level 10. The Cockatrice as well is here. Um, what can we do? Uh, I guess I'll try the Jawhorn. I don't know how the Tomberry will be at level 10. You didn't just get one hit by the Jawhorn? I mean, now the Cockatrice is going after them. Here we come through. Cockatrice is low. But we're getting poisoned. Oh boy, a 3k from a headbot. I took all three of them out. It's a single headbot. Hitbox must have been larger there. Ah, that was indeed a hard stopping bout. Rager in, Rager in. 4.2, 1.9, 4.2, 3.9. They say that this is the odds to win. Sea Devils out there. You got your Reaper King. Reaper King's low. I don't know why Reaper King's low. These two are the highest in terms of conditions, and I think that's why 
Trance available, but I'm going to go with Vesper Guardians because of numbers and the condition as well. Scary thing about using those three is just their numbers. The Sea Devil can be quite strong with their Water Guns attack. Where are we going? Oh, are we going to really go after the train here? No, no, no. Oh, why did you go after the train first? Oh no, this is bad. <laughs> Okay, we only got one more guy left. Oh, we are the last guy left against the train. Train needed to be like in a middle position there for him to lose. Uh, everyone getting up in the train, we would have won. So it goes with games of chance. All right, let's rage red 3.0 into a 3.5 and a 2.8. Oh, gee. All right. Um. Uh, I guess I'll go to Reaper King here. Reaper King does good against these guys, and it's a, a high condition. I'll try this. This looks good right now. Yeah. I guess I'll go with Resolve. Resolve looks good here. Bam! These bullets are gonna get one shot up for sure. Nice job. One point six. Let's go. All right, let's wager in. Nine point three into a two point six. Hmm. <laughs> let's go to nine point three odds. Let's go for the losing squad. How many of them are there? Four. No, five. Five of them. Five Reaper tails. Let's go. Oh shit, got one of them. He's got two. Come on, guys. Get your pincers out. Get your stingers out. Go, 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 go. Yeah, one's down, one's down. Ah, so close! Yes! 90k! Yeah! You see that? Damn, you really called it. Where to go, Noct? We're above 1.7 mil, closing up to 1.8 mil now. Anak versus War 2. Ugh. I know who's gonna win this. Let's go. These guys were the homies I would always vote for in the beginning. But I didn't really see them much in the last point. But now they're back. The War 2 squad. Nice. One's down. Alright, let's gang up on this guy. There we go. And he's poisoned as well. Good job. Yeah, you see that? Damn, you really called it. Way to go, Noct. All right, let's rage her in. 1.4, 2.9, 2.9, and 3.8. Cool. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Let's see. This guy's mega in, but however, there's a lot of numbers here. That everyone can just gang up on them. Condition sucks for these guys, so I'm gonna go with the. But these guys are like level 10 though. Uh, I'm gonna go with these guys. Feels like a numbers game for this one. 
Everyone gang up in Johorn and he'll just die right away. Like, look at the numbers everywhere except for Johorn. See, even the Hun legs are going after him. Uh, but we need to get our tenacity going up real fast. Why are we getting pushed away by the Mesmers? Oh, wow, we're losing badly. Yeah, no one went for the Jewel Horn. At all. We'll try our best at Tenacity. Mesmers! Like the level 10 Mesmers, dude. Yeah, Jewel Horn won that. You win some, you lose some. Alright, let's wager in. 9.8, of course, 1.8, and then the 3.6. Oh, but look at the... Ah, uh, I'm still gonna go with it. The condition is really low, but... Yeah, I'm, I'm good. Roost is in the middle. Alright, now they're gonna be attacking the Rooster. Should I just go with cleansing or should I just heal up? Let's go with cleansing for now. Get the poison off. And then we will clear up these loser squad. The Reaper Tail loser squad. Alright, heal up. Let's go. Body slam. One more to go. One more to go. It will do. 1,500. Alright, Rager in 5.3, 4.1. Gonna go with the 4.1. Let's go. Alright, Horn of Tenacity. So you guys go. Bam! You out, buddy. Like, why is one of my Vortooth just chilling? Run in there, buddy. Let's run. Go and chop off some scales. Go in for the meat, dude. Booyah, come to Papa. My word, the board is on the impossible. The word is on the impossible. Um, I think the Vortube could have this actually. They could do it against the Carvers. Ah, uh, I'm, I'm gonna go for it, but it's just. The thing is, like, with the, the war tubes nowadays, they've just been quite lazy. Like, if they just go in, like, all in unison, they will definitely have it. Oh, man. Like, like what this guy did, did, did like... No! Yeah, he's just gonna die because none of them just run up. They're all so lazy. This is why the guy is winning. And you're dead. <laughs> Cheer them with the Kudanta. This guy needs to do like mad dodges as well. If he can just do a lot of dodges, he can win. But uh, now we're vulnerable. He's going to jump on us with the claws right now. Dead. Yeah, it's, it's done. It's done. Game's done. We'll get, we'll get the shower treatment. We're done, dude. <laughs> no good. May our day. The day's still young. Day's still done. Yeah, exactly. Day is still young. 
Um, Havoc, Fisherman, these guys, and then these guys. Uh, I guess I'll go to 2.6 odds. They got good condition as well. Wow! That's a big chunk. I'm gonna go to Tenassi. Screw that healing that guy up. He dies, he dies. How much of our guys are left? Let me see. We got all of our four guys left. Alright, cool. And one of our guys has four health still. Who did he get? Oh, he got one of our guys with that water gun. Bro! Good god. Five point zero. We've got three point nine, two point seven, and a four point five. Condition is sucky for these guys. Uh, I guess I go to crab. If I lose one more, I'm gonna reset this and go for another set of monsters. We're losing quite a bit, and I want to boost up and get my money. All right, come on, come on, let's do this. Heal up, heal up, heal up. Nice sales. What? Yeah, let me let me um get out of here and then I'll get back into the Colosseum. That's what I need to do. This set of monsters is not for me, dude. It's not. <laughs> it's not for me, bro. Alright, let's go in. Ranger in, Ranger in! Got the Stag, got the Reaper King. Is this the same monsters? Let me leave. This looks like to me the same monsters we had before. So, Alright, cycle in again. Okay, Rage Run. 4.6, 1.7, 2.7, 4.6. Hmm. It's tough. I'm gonna go with the flexor task. It is tough because flexor task is strong, but they don't go in unison and attack each other one yes. person and I would love if they just went after one person to attack. Joe Horn's down. Alright. Oh they're taking out everyone. Oh, where's my other guy? Yeah there he is. And these guys are doing a good way of nibbling down. Good job. Victory! Victory! Alright, 1.5 into 3.9, which is going to 1.5 here. Oh, 
Well, my hands are going to be on the fortitude. Damn. <laughs> Okay, we go on. Good, good, good. Alright, we won this. Give him a headbutt. One more headbutt. Okay, shoulder charge. Alright, Rage you're in. 4.4 into the 2.9, 4.9, and then 1.9. Um. Um, um, um. But yeah, that condition's shitty. That's why they got really shitty odds. I guess I'll go with Crazy Horns. High condition. Big guy. Good level. Go to crazy horns. Who's gonna charge into the attic? And we get one of the mesmers. And one guy's charging over us. And he's like, oh, sorry. Wrong guy. Nice. All right, it's just me and the other horn, dude. That's what's up. It's only between me and the other horn guy. All right, heal up, heal up, heal up. Let's go. That was a good one. That was a good one. <sighs> that was indeed a hard stopping bout. Alright. Galleon Galvano. 2.4 and then we've got the Saber Force. Shitty condition. Of course, 9.4 Reaper Tail. I'm gonna go with the Sabres. Yeah. Table type. Everyone just go after the, the crab. Crab, 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 crab. Crab's nearly dead. Yeah. Next one, Horn. Oh, what? The Reaper Tail got one of our guys. Holy shit! One of those guys is dead again. We only got two more. Damn! One more left. Oh, dual one's done. Okay, we got this. We got this. Yes, yes. <laughs> That's what's up. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Booyah, come to Papa. Damn, you really called it. Where to go, not? Ranger in. All right, 3.7, 7.7, 1.9, and a 3.0. Hmm. These guys were very close for sure. Damn. Oh. I think I'll go with the Magnetus. I think I'll go with this guy here. Him in the Reapers. This would destroy them as well. When he's in this position there, it's just like boom, boom, with the kicks, boom. The big mighty kicks. Go heal up. Get the boot. 
Bam! Yo, got the jewel on as well. Oh, that was a big boot. All right, we just got two more Reaper Towers. One more. All right, give him the boot here. Bam, yes. Let's go. Sharp today. Sharp our day. Alright, let's rage up 2.1 into the 3.4 and then the 2.9. Uh oh. Okay. Hmm. I think I was gonna go with the Flexitas. Thinking, thinking, thinking. My thinking cap is Flexitas gear. Yeah? Magnet is down. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're just um, swarm them with the tenacity here. Let's go. Nice. Victory! So close to 1.9 mil. 2.8, 2.0, and then this is a 3.3, 7.1. Uh, this could be another Saber Tusk win. Alright, let's build up that tenacity. Alright, and now see build up four. One of our guys is dead already. Alright, swarming time. Wah, 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 wah. Buy them everywhere. This actually pushes up to 1.8, right? Oh, 1.9. 1.9 now. We are over. That. Let's go for two mil. Shit, if there was one of these, I, I would actually go for the Reapers. But because there's two of them, I'm gonna have to go with this these guys here. Damn. That would be nice if I can actually get a Reaper Tells and get good money with these guys. Alright, one's coming in. It's gonna actually get uh half hell. We'll hold these guys up here as well. Forward shoot is the horn we need to blow. Alright, one's down. Another one's down. What was it 2v2? 2v1. Yeah, that's unfair. Like, Reaper Tails can only win with just one yeah. big guy. And they just swarm on that. Damn. Keep them really binding them up. To go not. All right, Rager in 2.8. With a Magma, 2.0. And then Flexitas. With a Mesmer's. Mesmer's! Oh, man. I really want to go with the Mesmer's, but. These guys will just swarm them and just destroy them, yeah. I go with the Plexa Tusk. Drive that tenacity if possible. Whoa! Just yoinked him with that horn. Yeah, we'll go with the tenacity, yeah. Tenacity first one. Alright, let's go, let's go. How come my other guy is just relaxing around? 
get in there, boys. No need to rest. They didn't give you rest. Neither should you give them rest. Oh man, that's a saber tusk win. Gonna get 3.8k. 38k actually, yeah, 38k. 38k on this one. And it's five saber tusk as well. Get in there, boys. <laughs> Good stuff. All right, so close to two mil. I'm gonna go with this. This looks like the odds I should go for, actually. I don't even know why this is at higher. Well, I don't even know why this is at high odds here. This looks like the one. The big crab should beat the horns, dude, here. Despite the condition as well. He should be him. Yeah, let me heal up, heal up, heal up. Why, why is this guy beating me up? What? How could you do such thing to me? You win some, you lose some. All right, 4.4, 5.2, and a 5.4. Uh, Sabu, <laughs> Sabu <Same> squad. <laughs> oh man. Ah, oh, Sabu's gonna go after the dual horns, of course. All right, let's go after the Reaper King. Reaper King. Reaper King. Oh, he got two of us in that tackle. Get him, get him, boys! Damn! Yes! Sweet victory! We're above 2 million. Above 2 million now. Good stuff. Alright, Adrian, this is actually really low odds here. But, you know, we gotta have to bet on the spider. I always go with the spider. Whenever I see the spider, it's like... Fun times. Fun times, dude. Fun times indeed. I want to go with the spider, so let's go. Spider gang. Why are you going off the, the jewel horde? No! No! No, 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 back up, back up! Oh, that was shitty. So it goes with games of chance. Hmm, okay, Sabres. This guy, Ronin. Okay, Ronin for sure. Oh, is the flexing task coming after him? Holy shit! That was a big chunk! Whoa! <laughs> and those are the guys I was actually going to go for if I didn't see Rodin. Um Yeah, let's go, crab guy. Oh, that was painful though. Two losses on a row there. That was really painful. <laughs> Let's 
got a good chunk there. And also we got a good chunk. Oh, 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 what was that? What was that? Oh, he wins. Oh my God. Bro. Ah, <laughs> damn. All right, we got the one point of this, seven point. All right. Save this. Uh, we're going after the Reapers first? Are you kidding me? Why? Oh, this don't look good, man. Like our guys are split apart, dude, and we went off the after like the the worst one. I mean, crab guy is done, yeah. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. All right, fair enough. Since we lost a bit, we're down by just a tiny bit off to two mil. Tight odds, but gonna have to go to the Sabres. Just depends on the direction of where the Sabres go. And they got kind of shitty condition. Okay. So, we're well, after the Dual Horns first? Interesting. One of our guys is down there. Yeah, we're just getting, we're getting chummed down, <laughs> getting chummed down. Mhm. Mm still got it, uh, still got it. Good job. <clears throat> Five point two into a four point four. Five point two, of course. I'm just scared when he does the mobile kicks. Other than that, we should be fine against them. It's the Sabres gang. Oh boy, oh boy, you guys gotta do something here. Ah damn. Yeah, that's what I was I was worried for. Yikes, dude. This guy's so good at multiple enemies around him. But we got him. One more boot and we would have been finished. Well, give me that money. Alright. Joe Horn. Ashen Horn. Okay. They're all the big guys, so we just choose the strongest one here. Heal up, let's heal up. Heals, 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 heals. We're the 24, right? Yeah, we're the 24. Alright, 1v1 with my other veteran. Alright, we're just giving them shoulder pads. Shoulder pad. <laughs> you know, this guy is actually getting really good hits in, but it's sad because I'm the only one that can heal myself up. Which, no matter what, dude, you have to pull up some really heavy crits. Which did not happen. Our luck's starting to look 
up. All right, Rager in. 4.3 into a 4.6 and a 4.9. Big odds for everyone, actually, here. Well, I'm going to go with the Magnus. That's where my bet's at. Here we go. We're just, we're just kicking his booty now. Oh, we're in the middle of this. Have to be careful. I'm just going to heal up. I'm not going to do anything else but just heal up here. I don't like where our position is here. Oh, that's a good boot. Yeah, I just don't like the stomp. The stomp is where you'll actually mess us up. But now we're actually against two addicts here at full health. There we go. Nice. 1v1 clash with an attic. See that stump? Oh man. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts so much. Okay, we got 2.1 mil. I'll see how far I can go for the next 10 or 15 minutes. If we get a good win streak, then I'll go for that 2.4. If not, then we can try um, later tomorrow. Jewel horn into the brass next. Oh boy. Guess I'll go with the 1.4. Yeah, 1.4 seems fine here. Boom, 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 boom. Alrighty. I guess I'll go with Resolve, or is this a bad idea? Because now they're actually hitting me. <laughs> that was a bad idea. <laughs> yep, yeah, that was a bad idea. I should have just healed up. I would have survived that. Yeah. Oh, man. So much for that. So much for that, indeed, yeah. Alright, 3.4 into 3.8. Oh, but last time we got destroyed, right? Against this guy here. Okay, we'll put our bets on this guy. They hit harder compared to the crab, but I don't know if this was the right one to choose. Well, we'll see, we'll see. Now this one's hitting harder. Yeah, it must have been the bigger one that faced off against the crab. Damn. No good. Made our day. The day's still young. Anak versus the Ashen Horn. Four point one to six point five. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the 6.5. Let him stump him. Stump him, stump. Come on, guys, work together. I, I, I guess we can heal up. Oh, good stump. Oh, he missed his stump. He had plenty of time just to hit it. Help him out! Help your buddy out! Oh no! Don't let him die! Stop! Stop! Good stop! Yes! Yes! Oh good! Good stuff! Yes! He's actually finding the other guy! There you go! Teamwork! That's the teamwork I like to see! Alright, Rager in. Ah, I'm gonna go to the Savers.
the dangerous one is going to be the crab. They need to take care of the crab right away. Get the crab if you can. Come on, dude, get the crab. But doesn't mean that we lose as we win again. Yeah. You see that? We win. Damn, you really called it. Way to go, Knox. 42. Alright. Okay, so Anak into a 5.2, 5.2. The Mesmas. I think I'll bite with the Annex to win, to be honest. Very close odds, but I'll go with the Annex. Yeah, I'll go with that. That's fine by me. Nice stop. Oh boy. Let's heal up our Anak. Good job. Now he's vulnerable. Both of them are vulnerable now. What are you doing? What are you doing, Anak? Alright, let's heal up this guy. Where's my stump? There we go. Oh, I didn't get staggered. Give me another hill. Give me another hill. Nice. We're in the health position now. Keep up, keep up, guys. Another hill? Another hill for my Anak on the left? There we go. Alright, 20 seconds left. One more boot. Yeah! Stomp on him. Stomp on those horns. My word, that borders on the impossible. 2.2 mil. The 8.2. And then the 2.3. Hmm. The two point three is go to flex. All right, let's drive up the Tenassi. Yeah, baby. Good job. Oh, we're really low, actually. I should have healed up, isn't it? <laughs> I should have healed up. Now's your chance. Yeah, should have healed up. Uh, I should have healed up. Heal myself, dude. You win some, you lose some. Obelisk versus Crazy Horns. Uh, go Crazy Horns here. He will charge in first, right? Oh, it's the Reaper King that will charge in first. Oh, you didn't even hit him. Look at the Reaper King. Piling that damage, bro. You got the increased damage on me. But I have the horn.
One more hit. One more hit. One more hit. Okay. Yeah, my guy was loop balling around. Let's see more of that sharpness. Shot by day. All right, four point two into a six point eight. I don't know. Maybe we could actually get this done. We could actually get this. To be fair, with the annex, I'm actually impressed by actually bowing with the annex. So I think we're good. Yeah, I'm gonna bow on these guys here. Yeah. As long as the stomps come through, we should be right. Let me heal up. Yeah, this is not that bad. And he missed a stop. Yeah, double stop finish. Two point two seven. We're so close to two point four as well. Five point oh and then a four point three. Oh man. Because it's magnet, I'm gonna have to choose magnet on this. That's just the issue. It's magnet. Oh man. It's it's either between the stomps that can do massive damage or the magnet because he'll just crit them out at that level 13 there, yeah. Yeah, the stump came in. That's what I was really worried about. Alright, go crazy now. Go crazy those dudes. Come on, heal up, heal up, heal up. Damn, yeah, I should have been the us. Drops do good against Magnina. What a bummer. Yeah, it's all done. You win some, you lose some. <sighs> we became 4.8. Well, go crazy horns. Alrighty, crazy horns. Go crazy. Oh, Reefer King coming out this way. But our guy will help us out right now. now not. Oh, no, no. We're in the middle now. We're in the middle. We need to get out of the middle. Oh, no. Come on, my guy. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. Get the reap. So it goes with games of chance. That's another loss. Yeah, I guess I'll go with Flexitas. Let's just watch their health carefully. I'm holding on to the fortune. Yes. Oh wow. One of our guys is really low on health. Oh actually no, it was, it was actually the Okay, that was our guy's low on health, which we couldn't take care of in time, but our flex horse is. Oh uh, he's high. He's high on health. Okay, good. Good. Nice one. Ah, that was indeed a hard stopping bout. Alright, 1.6, a 3.5, 4.0, and a 2.5. Mm, 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 what's one? This one's a 21. Guess I'll try Flex the Tusk again in this scenario.
Yeah, we'll heal up as well. I want to keep both my flex tusks high up in health. All right, stay in there, guys. Stay in there. All right, just the annex. All right, one v one, one v one. Give you the help. I'll give you the help. All right, so this, does this push up to us to two point three mil? Let's check. Let's check right now. No. Still under 2.3. Damn, I think we should just go for the 5.0. Let's try it, let's try. Let's try to greet him the 5.0 odds against 2. Point whatever. Let's go for it. We need to charge in though. Our guys have to charge in first. Yes, he's charging in. Okay, this is good. Okay, good stuff. Damn. Okay, good, good stuff, good stuff. Oh, one of our guys is nearly dead. Hold on, hold on, hold on to it. Hold on. Ah. Did we get him? Yes. Good stuff. We're over 2.3 mil. Nearly there for 2.4. Okay. Jill Horn. Okay, we'll just go for these guys as well. Because it's a what it's a 14 against a 24. Yeah, we'll go with the, the 24 here. Last one was a 24 versus a 20. Go for the one. All right, let's heal up. Yes, all right. Good job. Yep, this pushes us to 2.341. Over 50k to go. At right, Reaper King. I'm gonna go with this guy here. I'm gonna go with this guy. Only scary one to him is the Reaper King. Alright, Reaper King's going in. Ah oh, no, let's go and attack the Reaper King first. Alright, we'll heal up. Ah, oh, you see, like, the damage of the Reaper King. Oh no. Hey, Raiden. What is up? Yeah, that was brutal, isn't it, right? We pickings just got some mad damage ratio. Killer for Y high at 1.8. I'm gonna go with the flexor task. The last time I had the flexor task against the um, samurai dudes. It didn't look so well. But yeah, how's your progress, Brain? In the game, you still just grinding, or are you looking for? to do some side quests because I was doing the secret dungeon side quest earlier whereby you have to do all those eight dungeons I've done four of those uh, actually we should go with Resolve oh you're still grinding okay cool 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 you must be really close what's your levels on your characters as well um, Noctis is at 96 for me.
90 Suffolk, you can't remember. So we're actually near around the same level, Dad. I've actually caught up to you. Because you was way past me in the earlier chapters. 5.2 into a 4.2. Ooh, I'm gonna go with the full. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. Try it right here. You slowed down. And you still haven't left the island. Why you? Ha oh yeah. So what accessories are you using, Dad? Like, are you using like XP accessories or are you using AP? AP stuff. Oh man, I need to check what AP stuff I have to kind of grind as well for the accessories. 8.9, 2.3, 2.5, and then a 1.6. Hmm. Let's go with the killer for higher. He's at good condition. It's more like using things you get AP for, like what, the, the, the driving and then the chocobo racing? You're talking about that stuff in the Ascension, not the accessory wise? Because there's a, there's, a, there's actually a good accessory you could use to gain AP faster. Oh, wow. Guy with the best odds just ran up to me and just slaughtered me there. No good. Main our day. The day's still young. Okay. Damn. Okay, I'm gonna go with the Magna, yeah. Let's try. Where's my guy at? Oh, he's there. Alright. He's just fighting against the Reaper Tails. Oh, but the Reaper Tails kind of nibbled on us. At least the Crab Guy is really low. Oh, no. He just took a big chunk of us. Oh, wow. The Anak took us down. Oh, Anak. Why? Why you do this to me? Uh, now close odds again. 4.8, 4.0, and 4.6. Okay, we'll go with the Reaper King then. Let's go with the Reaper King. Let's just try and go for it. Oh, Reaper King. Yeah, we're just focused on health. Oh, the stomp! Oh, no, you got me. I didn't want to get stomped on the Annex. That is the weakness to the Reaper King in this fight. The stomps. And again, oh, okay. That was good. Alright, give me some more health. Yeah, why is that guy changing bows? Damn, this is quite scary now. My Reaper King. Now's your chance. Okay, yeah, this is my chance. Sting him. Sting. Yeah, baby. Nice. One more, one more. Boy, uh. Alright, oh, oh, oh. one more win and we get 2.4. One more win. Alright, 2.4, 3 3.4, 4.2, and 4.5. Oh man, this is tough. Damn. Alright, go to back to this, yeah. We'll go with our guy. 
Spy condition is what? Two? Two under condition. I have faith. I have faith in this guy. This is whereby he gets really strong with the kicks. Yep. Now he's gonna go YOLO now. We just need to heal up right here. Heal up, heal up and run, 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 run. Okay, we got another guy. But we still need to heal up. There's a dual horn that's max health. Oh, we can just harass the horn. Harass the dual horn here. The mesmer, yeah. That's good, that's good. Oh, dual horn's down. Alright, 1v1. The evolved versus the unevolved, the basic. Which of course, if you evolve your Pokemons, you win. Yeah! You see that? Damn, you really called it. Way to go, Noct. There we go. I'll do one more. Or should I just nah nah? <laughs> Let's not do one more. Let's just get our prize. So onion bangle. We finally get it. Yeah, that's that's the best core. Okay. And now we leave. Because I don't want to lose and be like, oh, I have to do it again and win. and Because I'm underneath 2.4. Alright. So, let's go and check. Um, let's go, where is it? Where is a person that actually has something in terms of health? Bumto? Tempered Shield. Onion Bangle. Yeah, so this increases it super much. So this will give him 8,000. Um, Ignis. Which one can we give Ignis? Any of those, really. Gladio doesn't need it at all. Because he's got Magnetech Shield. But who out of the two? I mean, I guess I can give it to Prompto. Because if I give it to Prompto here, we are 8,000. Ignis is at 7, but I think it would be great if we give it to Ignis as well. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll give it to Ignis. So, which one? So, what? What's this exactly? This is increases maximum HP and nullifies fire attacks. And then this one. What does this one do? Or we might lose. Yeah. Okay. I'm. Uh, I, I think I'm just gonna go with this one then. Yeah. All right. He's max. He's max health now. So let's see our gang team. So max health on Ignis and Gladius. Now we need to actually get. Max health on Noctis and Prompto will be good. Looks good here. I don't know if I'll be able to get 2.4 mil in the next five days. That's the problem. But like the Colosseum, you need hours and hours to grind on that. Splendid. Where are we off to? It's not that easy just to grind onto it. Oh, you know what? I should have just rested. Just click on rest. Let me rest up right now. I want to go to Gentlemen, Cape KM. Oh, shit. We missed the rest point. The moment we used the gondola. Damn. All right. No worries. What is called Umbra? We know where we are. So, let's see. This way, yeah? This is the right way to go down, right? Or is it the other way? That can make it easier. No, no, no. We've made it the right way. Because I think there's two different sides to go down. But this is the right way to go down to get to the hotel here. Greetings. Will you be staying with us? No, I'm calling Umbra. Let's see. Travel to pass Lucius. Let's do that. Oh, good.
But man, what a day, what a day. Dungeon exploring and some Coliseum mix up as well. That was pretty good. What a day it has been. Alrighty, now let's return to the car. We head over to Cape Camp. Kit cam time, kit cam. Get some carrots. We're gonna sow those seeds for those carrots. Rest up. And then we'll call it a day. If you've done so much. Next part, we can actually even do the Medusa quest. Yeah, because I wanted to fight the Medusa as we're at a good level to finally silence her. And was there anything else we can do? Well, I want to, first of all, before, as I said, Adam, Adam on Taurus, the big tail. Mm, really looking forward to yours is cooking. I still I want to get that. the best accessories. Oh, don't be that way. It's different when a girl I don't want to just you. go straight for it and just be with shitty accessories. Yeah. Oh yeah, I need to call for the chocobo. Where's my whistle? Chocobo, hello. Let's go. Buddy, sees it out of place. Good, good, good. All right, rest up. Get the carrots. Give them to Tony. Sleep is asleep, dude. <laughs> it's all good. Oh, we only got 296 AP. Yeah, there should be a faster way. Once I can actually find the accessory I'm looking for for the AP stuff, it'll be much more better to grab it and get it going. Uh, let's call the Chocobo. Easy now. Easy now, buddy. Free carrots. There's. We'll meet again. <sighs> Hard and gill for fresh greens. Alrighty, let's give all the carrots over to Tony for some gill. These greens look great. My cooks and customers are gonna eat these up. 
I'll be look at this loam. These greens look great. I'll be back. Hard on gift. These greens look great. My cooks and customers are gonna eat these up. I'll be back to buy whatever you're willing to sell. So let me know if you got any leftovers. Okay. This is a good time to save and then move on. So yeah, so as I said, this part was just more post-game hunting, did more of the side missions, and also we went back to the Coliseum. So again, good time around with a lot of things that I was going through with this game. And then the next part, we're going to carry on that side quest of going through those secret dungeons, get a tackle the Medusa because we were good at enough level. And then also we might do some extra stuff as well because we did the whole uh, get the server snipe in the beginning. Might be some cool other accessories that are secret around that we can actually grab and get because we did grab the diamond bracelet all of a sudden. So that might be something we can do. So yeah, guess uh, see you guys next time for the next part.